All right. You came here for tacos? Well, you came to the right place. What's up, guys? The game is wrong? It is wrong, thank you. I fixed that one, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Honor Seeker. I fixed it. All right. I am going to use Pox's build here. <laughs> Do not level rolling magma. I'm doing great, guys. How are you? Obviously, we're going to follow Pox's build. So I'm making a Marauder. Do not level Rolling Magma on Witch. I'm trying to understand what this means. So I... Normally, you start Witch to get a Rolling Magma. Is that what he's saying? Okay, I see what he's saying. He wants me to get to, he wants me to make a witch, get to level four, don't level up anything, and then make my marauder, right? So this start seems exactly like what I'm used to. This start seems like what I'm used to. Okay. Okay. I hate rolling magma. I'd use anything over that. I used to hate rolling magma too. I've gotten very used to it now, so I don't mind it anymore. Okay. So.
Okay. Rolling Magma sucks balls. Jer Bear, thank you so much for the four months, my friend. Am I going to try the big mana stick Hierophant version? I don't even know what that is. Hi, Cajun. Everything's good here, man. How are you, buddy? Okay, well, I want to play... I want to play how you would actually play. So let's go Necropolis SSF. And I'm going to make a Witch. Even though I could buy... So I want to start on Witch. Let's get the timer going. Don't really know what I'm doing, so it's going to be a little bit slow. But people will have more fun if I have the timer up. second here guys let's send one email real quick i have a question for somebody Hey, bud, thanks for streaming. Yes, we're doing a brand new run. I'm going to try to learn Pox's build. So I'm going to be learning here. This seems like everything that I'm very, very used to. So I need to do... might have to do this twice so I can learn, but... I need to do Mercy Mission and Breaking some or whatever. Okay, let's just get it started, and then let's learn, and then we can go again. Okay, we're going to go on 9. One, two, one, two, one. The very sand shivers with malice. There's a power. <laughs> the dead will soon rise for me, not against me. You're doing the once human beta. Is that game fun? So I already have two things that I need. So it's telling me that I need to get my witch to level four and I need to do two quests. Is that correct? My witch needs to be level four and I need to do two quests. Okay. Well, since I'm only getting to level four, okay, I'm supposed to log out, by the way, and then go back in is what I'm supposed to do. Certainly rolling magma.
did my witch die? Just like my sisters. Um, my witch is on softcore, so no, my witch can't die. Still have my detonate dead witch, but I promised people that I would try Righteous Fire. People have been waiting for that. So I can't, uh... I can't keep... I can't keep skipping out on it or people are going to hate me forever. Okay, Mercy Mission, that's something that we have to do. And then I have to do one more quest, right? not doing righteous fire on which it says to start which I'm doing exactly what Pox is telling me to do just listening trying to listen anyway he said start which get rolling magma and some other things so I'm just trying to listen let me know if I'm doing something wrong If I'm playing incorrectly, I said do not level, do not level anything. Okay. Don't level the gems, yes. Oh, almost got one shot right there. Don't level any gems. Okay. Then I go in here, I take the portal back, I do the title island. And then I turn in all the quests, and then I make a marauder, correct? And then I make a marauder. Did I do that right? Okay. Uh, nope. Wrong thing. This way. The thumbnail will be fixed, Gabriel. That has to be fixed by Lee. My brother. He'll fix it. I, I noticed that it was wrong, but I can't fix it. He's the one that has the thumbnails. So it says D3, but it's not D3. I played, I would, I would still, I would have played D3 longer if my wizard hadn't died on hardcore, but if my wizard dead, that's, that's enough for me. Okay, so now I'm going to give, I'm going to turn these in. I want the Quicksilver. And I turn this in, and I guess I want Flame Wall. Okay. So let's go in two. I would throw everything in the stash. I would leave, and then I would create 
Uh, I'm, I don't know which one's Marat. This one? Yeah. First time righteous fire. Okay. Yeah, I promised you guys I would do this and people have people have been upset and I understand why that it's taken me so long to get it started, but here we go. I promised you I would do it, so I'm doing it. I am a person that keeps my promises. Yesterday was so nice. Did you like seeing uh, Ellie on stream? Ellie, Kirk, and Sarah, we were all playing together. It was fun. They are good friends of mine. Dude, that DoorDash order that they sent us for tacos, was that had to be at least $50. That was an expensive order. Can I just sit here and beat this guy's ass without doing anything? Okay, oops, I'm supposed to log out, my bad. And then that would put you right here. And then I don't think any of this helps me. So I'll take anything here. So then we go to the stash and I would grab everything here. Um, this wand is better than what I have. We can go double wand here. Um, six life is better than nothing. Let's put on a, a hat is better than not having a hat, right? Can't use the life flask yet. Okay, so then we go here. Did it... My clicking is not good. My clicking is not good. So now let's ID these shoes better than... Do they have move speed on them? Yes, they do. That's incredible. So that's an incredible start, right? Um, Should be more stuff. Let's take any belt. I know... I know that the armor the chest piece slows you down a little bit so you're not supposed to wear it yet but i usually play hardcore this is the problem this is where i don't know what to do so i'm just gonna have to copy pox so this is just gonna cost me time but that's okay where am i starting I'm starting right here and we are gonna go this way okay. now i can level it up right Okay, let's go. I, am I believe that that was an acceptable start. Now what I need to do is I need to... Where did my flame wall gem go? Where did my flame wall gem go? Do I think No Rest for the Wicked will be a good game? I do, but I think... Um, no Rest for the Wicked is not going to be a game for everybody because the difficulty is extremely high. So if you do not enjoy difficult games, if you don't enjoy games where you're going to die hundreds and hundreds of times just to kill one boss, that is not going to be the game for you. I will play on release, yes. This is the wrong way. No, it's correct. This is not hardcore, but I did pick SSF. I could go hardcore if you want me to. I can start over and go hardcore. It doesn't bother me. 
but I figure I've died so many times on hardcore so far this league that maybe I should go softcore once to learn. You played WoW for 12 years as a mythic raider, then no rest for the wicked will be good for you. Yep. That will be a good one. I don't know what this does, but I'll take it. Can't be a bad thing. So we need two goat horns, right? Goat horns are the best. Because they have, um, like, a, a, a damage to spells implicit, right? So you get two goat horns, I'm guessing, and then you just plow. Just plow from there. I have this. Clicked it 300 times. I'm going to try again here in a second. Okay, I got it. Pox is checking me out. Oh, God. Oh, no. Everyone in the PoE community never watch me. I have no idea what I'm doing, and I'm dog shit. Nobody watch me. Oh, no. Buckbeak is going to be over here. Hey, you're supposed to kill the blue enemies, right? Is it actually over here? I'm going to be so sad if it's not this way. I'm going to be so sad. Doesn't It looks like I was going the right way. This is why I'm, I suck at this game. I was going the right way, but we're going to get that legendary Buckbeak, whatever his name is, from Harry Potter. Got to be. Okay. Well, that was a terrible time. The mule cost me so much time. Is Last Epoch beginner friendly? It absolutely is. Um, you really could probably fire up the game with no help and succeed. But I do have a beginner's guide that I made. It's one hour long. Seems like a daunting video, right? But I would like to think that if you watch my one hour Last Epoch beginner guide, it will save you way more than an hour of time in the actual game. So if you just watch just that one, that should be enough for you. Pox is here. Pox, what's up, buddy? I'm going to do my... Don't be shy. <laughs> what's up, buddy? Thank you. That's nice of you. Oh, not even high enough level to use it. I'm crying. So I don't know what I did. I had I thought I had flame wall, but I must have I must have sold it. Cause I'm stupid. I must have sold it. That's how smart I am. I sold it. Splitting steel. I don't want that. Chance to bleed, momentum. Okay, let's check his guide. I don't use any of these. So let's take anything and just sell it. Alright. Um, now, I already have movement speed boots. So 
So was I supposed to buy Holy Flame Totem? Maybe. I don't think I did this right. I'll take Steel Skin. Uh, Alright, let's go over here. Let's see if she has two goat horns. I did find an orb of chance. So I I messed this up somehow. Maybe I was supposed to buy Frost Blink and Flame Wall or something. I just don't know where they went. I had Let me see something. Can I buy what can I buy from her? Okay, I can buy Frost Blink. Can I buy Flame Wall? My Holy Flame Totem, I need that. I don't have a red socket anywhere. So my only thing that I didn't... The only thing I messed up on is I sold my Flame Wall Gem. So I'm just going to cheat here so I don't have to start over. Okay. Well, I'm missing my favorite skill right now. I don't have... I don't have um, a red socket. So that makes me sad. So what we're supposed to do... Is we're su not supposed to do what I'm doing right here. What we we're supposed to do is we're supposed to walk to the bridge. And then leave a portal. Walk forward, grab the waypoint, then go to the portal. So I'm going to lose a little bit of time here. I'm pretty sure I did it wrong. Another thing, I did another thing wrong, by the way. I bought two goat horns there. I bought two goat horns. But, I didn't need to do that yet. I should have been more patient, because I'm going to go back to town one more time before I can even equip them anyway. So I should have just waited. See, I miss having my totem here. It would be so nice to have a red socket, but I don't have one. This guy's murdering me. I'm supposed to throw it right in front of him, right? Yeah, I'm playing SSF. But I don't have my little flame totem, which makes me very sad. I need my flame totem. So everything that I have here sucks. Does she have a good goat horn? This is very good, right? 
this is what we want. It's the three link blue and the and the thing has. So let's do this. Excellent. So I can sell this one. So something like that is what we wanted. So that's good. So I can swap those in a moment. Yeah, Chaos Gems is not what we wanted. So the reason why it would have been faster is this whole walking sequence, I didn't have to do this if I would have just played properly. God, I hope that was the right thing to take. It was. Okay, thank God. So what we are looking for is the some kind of bridge, right? Pretty sure. Now, in Path of Exile, you are not supposed to kill anything, really, except for blue enemies, right? Or massive density. Blue enemies and massive density only. Can I have that? I'm just going to skip it. There's too many monsters there. I'm crying. I'm so bad. Still can't wear my goat horns. Boy, I wish I had a red socket. Okay, so here's a blue. So these are the guys that we could kill. And we just keep throwing rolling magmas behind us, right? So in two levels, I should be a lot stronger, or in hopefully this next level is the one where I can not be a little bitch. I need 29 in to even equip, to even equip them. Okay, it's still alive. No one's more surprised than me. Phenomenox, good morning, Rax. Thanks for everything you do. Looking forward to five more years of content. Thanks for answering some of my questions in your videos. Yes, sir. You're welcome, man. Hell yeah. So essences are good. Should be fine, maybe. sell this yellow unidentified, right? Fire and ignite resistant. Of course they're resistant to the thing that I do. Why, why wouldn't they be? When do I get enough int to wear these things? I have 26 int. I need what? 29. Do you get more stats for leveling up in this game? 
I need int on gear. No, you don't. Okay. So you have to find an item with plus int on it in order to wear these goat horns. This is going to be a massive damage increase for me. What does assassins do? This is a bit dangerous. Now, let's just ride on by here. Lapis from neck or a passage tree, okay. The slave is not a man. The slave is not even worthy of death. Where's my holy flame totem? I cannot do this yet. Warrior's blood and then This gives me twenty int. Okay, that's gonna solve it for me. Let me s uh let's just good enough. The tail of Added fire damage seems to make sense. Maybe this does something someday. Mm -hmm. Let's buy this a second time, because apparently I vendored it. Because so that's how smart I am. Uh Okay. Hello. So, I need to gain one level before I fight Brutus, right? And now I don't need to gain a level because now I have this, right? Okay. So that makes sense why Pox recommended that. Absolutely makes sense. So it's rolling magma. What is it? It's rolling magma, and is it elemental proliferation? Let me see. I'm guessing it's... Uh... Okay. So we need elemental proliferation, right? Uh, we also need combustion. Maybe, does she have that yet? Maybe I just go with combustion for now? Farewell. Does that work? What little help I can offer is yours. Okay, how's that? Uh, okay, I'm... First of all, I messed up here. I messed up. So first of all, I want to put this here, and I want to cancel this, and then I want to take that off. Alright. Here we go. Now I'm playing. Don't know where to go. Okay, now I'm actually frying. Okay. On the right way, that's nice. I believe it was I'm Exile said that you want to be level 9 before you. You want to be 9 before you fight Brutus. I don't know why, but I'm sure that's important for some reason. So let's make sure that we do that. Don't know where to go. Let's just run real fast. If you stay on the edges, you can't be going the wrong way, right?
What is that? Strong box. We don't get a French toast about that, do we? Yeah. Rude. Okay. I don't know where I'm going. I hope I'm going the right way, but probably not. Oh, do you have to swing around? Which way do you swing around? Does this way work? Okay, yep. So armor scrap, we can vendor for scrolls, right? Your brawn is about to meet its match, brute. I cannot do this yet. Strongbox is good because it drops flasks. Okay. What what is happening? Why am I holding a belt? Definitely feeling how shitty my flasks are, that's for sure. My mana is gone. Your spirit is the plaything of the ancestors, slave master. I don't know what to do. Let's check in the loading screens what to do. Okay, it looks like we're going down actually. This way? I always go the wrong way here, so it's, it has to be this way, right? This has got to be right, and then it's going to swing around, I believe. I don't think I even have a pair of gloves. So any gloves got to be better than no gloves, right? For some reason, it feels like my damage is pretty low. Maybe I did something wrong. What's this game? This is actually a Diablo 5 beta. How's it looking? This is the Diablo 5 beta. Yes, it's a closed Diablo 5 beta.
Yeah, I actually wasn't supposed to show this to you guys. The NDA is broken. Reported. Okay, I don't know the logic on where the exit could be, so I'm just going to follow the edge. Don't know the logic, so... If I follow the edge, it should be alright. for an exit. Can I buy a vowel in E? There's a pirate treasure that looks like a jibate. There's an essence here. Damage and fire resistant, of course. Of course. The only thing in the game that I can't kill is what I spawned. This is my surprised Pikachu face. Somehow I still haven't found the exit here. There. Is this the exit? Man, that was a long run, man. So the hint here is... Follow the water. Follow the water. Well, I don't see any water here, so that's not good. That's this has got to be a dead end, right? What about if I go this way? Maybe we'll find some water here. If I go this way. Still using baby flasks. Okay, we're supposed to kill the blues. We're supposed to kill the blues, and that's it, right? So let's go this way, this way. Let the totem burn everything. I cannot do this yet. Flame surge. That's something that we need. <clears throat> Let's go this way. Alright, I see a door. There's a blue right there. Let's kill the blue. I'm frozen. I'm frozen again. Okay, I... Can never move again? Okay. Dead, treasure chests. Okay, monsters. That sounds like a lot of work. I don't think I want to kill them. Let's just move forward. Level am I? I'm 12. What am I supposed to be when I'm leaving? It's like a good level.
Don't have any cold resist, by the way. And my damage is not very high, and my flasks are terrible. So the only thing wrong with my character right here is everything. The only thing wrong with my character is everything. Yeah, I need to get some kills so I can get some mana going. Uh, okay, I can't even fight. This is not fun. Boy, I wish I had some mana. I mean, I don't even have a TP to go back and get mana. This is brutal. Well, uh, I don't know what to do here. What, what, what do I do? Just, should I reset and go get better flasks? I mean, I can't even play here. Okay, I guess I just leave. I don't know. I can't TP out. I don't have a scroll of TP. All right. Um. Well, that was interesting. I've never had that happen to me before. That that was a first for that one. Hello. I never had a character so dog shit that I couldn't even fight the boss. That's a new one for me. Do I have any flasks? Hello. I think we take we do use leap slam at some point. Um, what does Pox say to do here? Guess we just keep going up, right? Um, well. I can't play the game because I don't have enough mana. So I have to find a mana. Can you buy a mana flask? Can you buy one from a vendor? From Nessa, okay. This was multiple minutes down the drain. Many minutes down the drain. Do this yet. Can somebody drop me a flask? Any flask havers? I need to pay way more attention to my flasks. I have picked up a lot of nice flasks and I just sold them all. So that I need to stop doing that. Large mana flask. God, sometimes dreams do come true. Wow. Lagus, how we doing, buddy? Nice to see you, man. What's up? Oh. Oh, Mervil's already at half health. Okay, I like that. I need to use my mana very carefully.
Let's see if she can kill me. I don't have any cold res here. My damage seems pretty good. My damage seems to be there. My, uh... Okay. That wasn't... Could have been worse. Alright. All I needed was another mana flask and I would have been fine. I was just missing a mana flask. I, I in general, that's one of like probably the weakest part of my PoE game is I never pay attention to the flask. I just don't care, but I I need to care. I need to care big time. So that was terrible. That was a forty-eight minute act one with a mule, but. That's terrible. I have seen many I I would like to sell everything I picked up, right? Small life flask I can sell with a clear conscience. Am I gonna do a detonating arrow build planner? What do you mean? I already You mean for last epoch? The I already made two videos on it. There's two videos on my YouTube explaining everything to do. Is that what you mean? I need a hundred fire res. Okay. So I need to start building fire res everywhere. Okay. If I remember correctly, the correct order to do this in is left, up, and then right. I shouldn't have to do the right one, though. So I go left and then up. I cannot do this yet. The Eternal Empire. So we only stop to kill the blues, right? That's a chrome. I'll take a chrome. Yeah, so I think I have... I think I have the trial done, certainly, because I did a million runs on... Because I did a million runs on... My detonate dead character. By the way, I think I'm going to go back to the detonate dead character. I think I gave up too quickly on it like a little bitch. Okay. See, I was going to run past that greater mana flask. I need to stop doing stuff like that. Okay, there's a waypoint that I could get there. May not... I mean, it's two steps. Might as well go pick it up. So I spent way too long in that zone. That's for damn sure. What do I do now, Mr. Pox? I take this. And now we're going up this way. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay, okay. Supposed to kill the blues. So I'm killing the blues. And then I run away. That was a three link silk vest. It's interesting. Why are there so many 
gems on the ground there. Don't know where to go. There's a blue here. Hopefully that killed them. Don't know where I'm going. Let's run this way. One thing that sucks about not killing anything is I never have any Quicksilver charges. I cannot do this yet. Heavy belt, that's either, can't remember, it's either like a strength implicit or a life implicit, right? I don't know, what do I do? Log out, talk to her, and then go up or something? Don't know who to talk to. Oh, jeez. Uh, do you go Herald of Ash here? He doesn't take any of them. Let me see, 21. He's going to take Vitality. Is that a choice? Wah. Okay, I don't think... I'm not sure that any of these are used. Okay, let's check this out. It's the Strength Implicit. So I need to find Fire Res. Yeah, we go Vitality, okay. Thank you. Yeah, if you guys have any info, if you guys... Well, this sounds like a lot of you play Righteous Fire. If you see anything I'm doing that's really stupid, let me know. You can backseat me, you can make fun of me, you can teach me. I am trying to learn PoE, I'm not good at it, so... I'll take, I'll take, the, uh, take the instruction where I can get it. That's the only way that you get better. If you're a closed-minded fool, you're never going to learn. I'm playing SSF. I'm playing SSF on this season. Just get fire res and life. That's all you need. Okay. We can probably do that. That doesn't sound too bad. Oh, God. Ghost Runner. <sighs> Looks like my damage is pretty low. Did I do something wrong? I do have a three link with my rolling magma. It's combustion and arcane surge, I believe. That must be not right, huh? Is there a better three link than what I did? Elemental proliferation, maybe in combustion. Your death had more. Take Proliferation instead of Arcane Surge. Thank you. God Slayer. Thank you. Here's a Yeller Belly. Cold Res, not what we wanted, but maybe what we deserve.
I don't know. I hope that's the right one. That's the only way to go, right? It has to be, right? The spire, the fire spreads with it. Okay. Thank you. Oh my god, Einhar. Are you serious, bro? This guy? Einhar always wants me to do so much shit for him. He's so needy. Okay, actually, this is one of the only zones I know what to do in because you just do everything. So the way that I understand this zone, you follow the road, you get the waypoint, you go to the south, you kill the guy, and then you have to go left and right. On one of them will be the spider thing, and on the other thing will be one of the... And on the other thing will be uh, the bandit, right? I'm pretty sure that's it. It's pretty easy to memorize zones when you have to do the whole zone. That actually makes it easier. I guess I'll take a yellow, right? Because you sell on ID yellows and they're good. So you just follow the road until you get to the bottom. I'm just trying to get some kills so I can get some quicksilver charges. And then you drag him toward the seal, right, to save a bit of time. You go here, here, then you log out and go to Act 1, and then you port back and do the other two things, right? So like this. Guess while we're here... Let's be a little bit careful on what we're vendoring, because every time I freaking sell stuff, I sell stuff that I actually need. Okay, I would sell armor scraps here for wisdoms, so I would have these wisdoms, but I'm just going to cheat and grab some wisdoms. Okay, so this is much better than mine. Greater mana flask is better than this. So what else can I get rid of? This... I guess we're... I can use Herald of Ash right now, can't I? I'm pretty sure I can use it right now. For now. Let's put this... Let's go here like this. Can I put it on? Oh, I need to... Duh, I need to put it here. I'm trying to put it down here. That's how dumb I am. Close here, Herald of Ash. Okay. Then we want to keep Leap Slam right here. Lista, we're going to sell that later. Arcane Surge, I'm not sure that we need this. We can just throw it somewhere. And now I can turn that on. And I believe we're going for the Fire Mastery here. He takes the top three there. Turn on my aura. And now one way is going to be the spider, and the other way is going to be the bandit. Alright. This should be this way. One of them will be over here for sure. One of them is on one side, so this is the spider area, that's fine. I'm playing solo cell phone, yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to learn the game. And I think playing every all of the PoE quote unquote pros have told me 
if you want to learn the game the fastest as the, the way to do it is via ssf because then you can't just trade for the items that you need to solve your problems you have to actually solve your own problems I don't think I'm going to be able to get to a point where I can actually teach people how to make some very advanced builds and how to kill the uber bosses, etc. If I don't learn how to do it completely on my own where nobody can help me. Did I ever play Diablo 2? Well, I have 10,000 hours in Diablo 2 and in the ma in the mega d2r race for season one for world first to 99 we got first place so yeah i, I played diablo 2 we won we won the most important d2r race there ever was yeah i played diablo 2 i love that game no i didn't want to do that it's fine though just two enters instead what did we win we got well there was no there was no prize for blizzard didn't have any prizes for it it's just everyone was racing because it was the first season of diablo 2. never played titan quest kirk you guys remember yesterday's stream kirk is ellie's husband um, he, he and Ellie love Titan Quest, so they want to play Titan Quest with me on stream sometime. Would you guys be interested in seeing Titan Quest? I never played it before. Because Titan Quest 2 comes out this year, right? Did any of you guys watch that race? Did any of you guys watch the uh, Diablo 2 world first race to 99? Any of you guys watch that one? Honor Seeker did, Coastzilla, Zombie did. You were too young. I mean, this was literally like a year, a year or two ago. This was recent. This was like two years ago. Am I streaming on Twitch too? Yes. I'm dual streaming, but I have the chats merged. It used to be... It used to be that... Uh, um, I got way, way more chatters on Twitch than YouTube. That is slowly changing. YouTube is definitely making a big comeback. Comeback of the century. Quinn could teach me a lot about this game on what not to do. Yeah, but I have a serious question, though. 
isn't Quinn a lot better at this game than you guys give him? Like, everyone makes fun of him for making bad builds, haha, -ha, and dying, but isn't he actually good at Path of Exile? He's really good. He's good. No, he's bad. He's better than 99% of his chat. Yeah, I mean, like, I get it. Everyone's making fun of Quinn. That's, like, the funny thing to do, but... If Quinn wasn't streaming... Let me put it the, this way. If Quinn wasn't streaming, and he was doing a race, and he was just focused and played, and he played a meta build, wouldn't Quinn dominate? Wouldn't he do... Like, he wouldn't win. Like, Ben exists, right? But he would do well. Like, like, for example, Quinn against me in Path of Exile would kick the living shit out of me, right? I've never even attempted an uber boss. I don't even know what they do. He would own me. I'm trying to follow Pox's build, yes. Probably pretty soon people are saying that I can switch to Righteous Fire. I don't have any, I don't think I have a single point of fire res though, which is bad. Maybe I can buy the fire res rings from the vendor or something. Well, I've went every wrong way here, just wasting tons of time. Vendor recipe, you can break him. An iron ring with a red gem, okay. Ancestors, forgive me. I have opened the way to Kitaba, father of corruption. You need a... Is there, like, some magical reason about a hundred fire res? Like, if you have 90 fire res, you can't switch or what? Is that who just messaged me? Is that Pox? I don't know. How, I, like I, I'm genuinely very confused by the Poe Whisper system. Like I never know who is who. Like Zizarin was messaging me, and my whole chat was laughing. Hey, you're not. You're ignoring Zizarin. I'm like, bro, how am I supposed to know that Zizarin? The whole, the whole Whisper system confuses me tremendously. I'm always confused. Yeah, I saw Pox is here. He's a super nice guy. I had a long chat with him a couple weeks ago. I was going to start Righteous Fire, but then people told me to start detonating dead, but detonate dead, I mean. So this needs to be this, right? Regenerate one for one, I think.
So what was I at? I was at 49 minutes in Act 1. And I'll take those for sure. 49 minutes for Act 1. Which was terrible. Even with muling, I think 49 minutes is dog shit. Okay, can, are you saying we can already go Righteous Fire here? So should I switch right now? Fire res first. Okay. Let's... I have the fire mastery. Now I need a hundred fire res. So what I would do is I would get iron rings and vendor them. I would get iron rings and I would vendor them. So I need a scepter and a shield. So do I have a suffix here? So I have a suffix on this one. Do I need maybe close combat or no, none of these. None of these, okay. Uh, let's take anything then. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out here. So I got three, let's start with this. I got three of these. So I think I picked up all of the nodes that he told me for the first round. So now we are gonna walk this way where is the i guess let's just pick this up first okay um all right so now what i need to do is i need to save a shield so i need to take this off put the shield on maybe we put this on okay uh, and I need to put fire res everywhere. What's my fire res right now? 21. Okay, so let's go to my hideout. Can I put fire res on this thing? Obviously the baby one. That's all we would be able to do. Okay. Can I put fire res on this thing? I can. Okay. Can I put fire res on this thing? I guess let's throw life on it then. Can I put fire res on this thing? Yep. Okay, how am my fire res looking now? Uh, well. Is this the, the number is 75? Is that what it's telling me? Okay, I do have an iron ring. Okay, let's learn here. So iron ring with Harold of Ash. Hello. Nice. There's a ruby ring. Very good. Let's uh let's alk it for fun. Okay. Now how much do I have? 102. Okay. Now, now what am I doing? Run righteous fire by this point. Okay. So let's get rid of all of this. Okay. So, Righteous Fire. Hail God Slayer. Righteous Fire. 
Uh, let me see. Which of these is better? I guess we don't. We need to use a. Uh, we need to use a scepter. I don't have a scepter yet. I guess I'll find one later. So for right now, let's just go righteous fire. Um, let's see here. What would I have? I would have, could I have, I wouldn't have, would I have elemental focus by now? Maybe. And then I need burning damage. I don't have burning damage, but I could get eff efficacy. Okay. Something like that. Okay. And then I need fire trap with efficacy and elemental focus again. Okay. Never used this build. Never used this before. Fire trap. Okay. So let's put maybe this here. Let's cancel this. Let's get rid of this. Are we still using flame wall? No. Flammability. We need. Flammability with life tap. Apparently, I can still attack with rolling magma. Armageddon brand. Okay, I like I like that. I know that one. Can't use Purity of Elements yet. Could use Blood Rage. Okay. Blood Rage. Okay, well, I need this someday. Okay. And now I need Flammability. Okay, can't use that. And then I need life tap. I need a couple of life taps. Take that. I'll take that. Um, he also says to get summon stone golem. That's later. So I can put a life tap in here. I can still keep playing rolling magma. And then we can do combustion. So I can still throw rolling magmas if I want. I don't get to use my totem anymore. That makes me sad. So we can go like this, I guess. Oops. If we want to keep using rolling magma, which no one would in their right mind would ever want to keep using rolling magma. And frost blink it goes here. Okay, I think... I think all the rest of this can go. Um, I need a faster attacks. And I need a shield charge. Okay. So, we are about done here took me an hour but maybe kind of figuring it out so shockwave is gone don't need that i do need shield charge uh i don't know let's just get rid of all of it let's start by vendoring that And these are the things that I need to add. I don't need Holy Flame Totem. 
so I need to get what happened to my shield charge did I vendor my shield charge Wah. that's how dumb I am I vendor the thing I didn't want to vendor. Okay, so now I need... I need this to be red red if I could. I wouldn't have very many chromes, but... Shouldn't be that crazy hard to get it. Okay, yeah. So... No, it needs to be red red. And... That's the end of the season. Okay, time to install Diablo 2. Or Diablo 3, or any of them. Uh, okay, well, rip. Okay, so let's try this. Let's put Righteous Fire on. Okay. Alright, how was that, guys? Righteous Fire on. How does this go? Okay, I'm already having fun. I love doing nothing. God, I love doing nothing. What do I do? Spam fire trap on them? There's something very satisfying about just running over monsters and them just burning to death. <laughs> Is there a uh, aura that I should be having on? What aura should I have? Vitality? God, I love doing nothing. So then you would curse them with flammability later? Okay, so how do I scale my damage? Life scales my damage? Is that is that a true statement? Is there any other way to scale my damage other than life? Life, spell damage, damage over time. Not spell damage. Okay, spell damage doesn't increase it. What about... Okay, so like percent fire damage would work. That's why we want a scepter.
Yeah, the curse that I want is flammability, right? There's a scepter right there. I give this warrior of Kitava to you, Chukohama, So at least that has the implicit of that at least has the implicit of increased elemental I assume increased elemental damage also works. That does that also give me damage? Increased elemental. Do I need to stack as much fire res as I possibly can, or is it just a hundred and stop? Okay. So if I had 200 fire res, that would be good. Do I stack any other resistances or just fire res? Cammy. It's okay. She's having a nap. <coughs> Callie, come here. Come here. She had a nightmare and it scared her. She got scared. Hi. Yeah. Do you have a nightmare? I heard you. So I woke you up. Good girl. A strange good luck. You can go back to sleep now. Goodbye. You are a welcome sight. Have to pet Callie. She had a nightmare. Okay, good girl. She's like, why did I walk over here again? Um, excuse me, Callie. I just saved you from having a nightmare. You owe me. Do I have any shitty essences that we could use? Anything with fire res, lightning damage, cold damage to attacks, cast speed, physical damage, regenerate, energy shield. Here's increased fire damage. This might be a super... Okay. Fire res, all elemental res. Okay, so this is pretty good, right? Okay, now I need the vitality aura. Um, let's keep this one. So I'm going to try to stack as much fire res as I can possibly get. Okay. Watch yourself. What do I need here? I need to be level 24. I can't even use this yet. So let's go here and go like that. So let's go to my hideout and buy Vitality. I don't have a red socket. So let's see if we can get some more sockets going here. Good enough. Orb of Binding, yes. 
Orb of Binding. Absolutely, I forgot about that. What's better, life or fire? Or wait, I already crafted on this. What am I talking about? Okay, can't put fire as on this one, so let's put life. Can put life or fire res is better. Okay. Can't put anything on this. Hail, God Slayer. This is. <coughs> yeah. God damn it. Alright. Let us, let's go here. Let's see if we can buy a shitty amulet from the vendor. Watch yourself. Are there any good implicits? Maybe, what do we need, int? We need dex. Let's get dex. Watch yourself. Okay, we got an orb of alchemy. Let's throw it on here. This is as bad as it could have been, but it's better than mine. Now let's go put life or fire res on it, something. Okay. Trying to put as much fire res on my gear as I can. Okay, so now let's go play. Hopefully we did that right. Okay. We need to put vitality here. And take vitality off of here. Oh yeah, uh, make gloves, yes. Yes. Not very good, but good enough for now. Okay. By the way, I'm never going to use this rolling magma nonsense. Never going to use it. I wish I had a chrome, man. I don't have any chromes. I need to get a red, red link. And then I can... Move faster, right? With shield charge. Okay, let's turn on Righteous Fire. Just gonna stand here and do nothing. Okay, now these are better than mine. Let's do a timeout here. Hold on. This is going to be pretty good, right? Okay, Orb of Binding. Do I have a... Where is it? Oh my god, I got a million of them. Oh, it has to be normal? Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Okay, it has to be normal. Okay. Can you believe... I didn't get another red one. That makes me sad. Okay, well, I need a chrome. I could scour it. That's a good idea. Let's do that. It even has fire res already on it. Beautiful. So... We can go Blood Rage. And then I need faster attacks.
I don't think I'm ever going to use rolling magma ever again. Oh, I know what's going on. I just realized what's happening. I have a gem tab. I was wondering, I was like, I don't think I'm vendoring everything, am I? I was like, okay, but I still don't know where it went. And then I need one more red, but I don't have a chrome. Flammability is coming soon. And then there's one more thing that I need. I need burning damage. Okay, I'm not going to get to use that for a long time. Okay. Oh, Blood Rage isn't an aura. Okay, so let's take this off. Blood Rage. Maybe here. Yeah, this is pretty fun. Is there a way you can make the the aura around you like seven times bigger so it just hits the whole screen? Is there anything else in the crematorium? Oh, yeah, fine, fine, Tolman, okay. <laughs> this is so funny, you just don't do anything. It's great. God, I love doing nothing. owed me? Huh. Didn't think that would be possible. 
guess I'm not as invincible as I thought I was. I don't have any res but fire, but I thought that's exactly what I thought that's exactly what we were trying to do though. I should have just dodged the attack. I just stood there and did nothing. I could have easily lived if I would have just moved. I thought that my regen would be good enough, but it wasn't. It's fine. I'll just move next time. Not until you get your ascendancy. Oh. Okay. Well, I mean, I have 185 fire. And only 11 lightning. Wait, she, she died? I won? No. Where, where is she? You can just dodge it. Not a big deal. I just, I genuinely didn't think she could kill me. I can use flammability now. So that will be very good. I'm assuming this is going to be very strong. I assume that's going to be Mucho El Goodo. Forty seven life. I'm guessing that this is the biggest piece of shit ever. Put vitality on. I I have vitality. Do I take recovery mastery? Yes. Fifty life per second. Is there a reason why Righteous Fire turns off every time you change a zone? Link flammability to life tap. Okay. Think about how I might do that. Life tap is red, flammability is blue. Don't quite have that option, but maybe I can fix my boots with an orb of binding or something. Wow, well, these guys are getting tomahawked. Make sure that it isn't this way because every time I do the damn sewers I always miss the third one it makes me very angry I don't want to be angry so let's just check it while we're down here Hey, 
it looks like once again for the 300th time I missed it somewhere. We will kill those guys in a second. Is that a quest that you need to do? Do you need to find all three of the bus in the sewers? I was going to say, am I doing this for nothing? I could orb of binding those greaves. That might solve my problem. Okay, we, I know we don't have to do this one. For sure. Teleported straight into a wall. Do we need to do catacombs if we do we have to do catacombs if we don't need the trial? Okay. Take the scroll of wisdom. Dude, shield charge absolutely blows in little cor corridors, man. It's like unusable. Rax is the new pox. No, no, I'm not. I suck, man. He's an MLG pro. How we doing, Frosty? I genuinely laughed at the last video that you made. God, that was funny. Flammability on him. This guy is an actual god. What happens if I kill his friends? I kill his friends will he be mad I cannot carry this cannot carry him um Jesus all right I got too much shit I'm trying to go fast here but I got too much stuff I think we're going somewhere for elemental damage somewhere. Who would be wrong to do that? Goodbye. Yes. Yeah, I don't know if anybody else feels this way, but the the real the real version of this song or the non-acoustic version, I think is like the electric version, I think is way worse than the acoustic version like i can't i don't even have the regular one in my playlist but i think the acoustic version is godly i'm very surprised that what is it i think this version is significantly better All right, so I guess let's. I guess if we have it, let's let's cheat here. 
fire res and movement speed and life regeneration. This isn't any good, right? We don't want that, right? Okay, so he said link flammability. Oh, this is where my faster attack went. God, I'm dumb. Okay. Any other tricky th things I can do? I need to link shield charge to life tap too. I wonder if this works. Does this does this put both flammability and shield charge with life tap? Does it make them both cost? Wow. Sometimes dreams do come true, boys. So, okay. God, I have the itchiest nose ever. Frost blink can go anywhere. Yourself. We're just going to keep going up till we get to this point. Okay. Let's go like this. Let's go to the hideout here. go life We're just going all in on fire res can I use my scepter yet Um, how am I going to make this work here? Can I make this a blue, blue, blue one time? Oh my god, yes. Okay, what are we going to do here? Damage over time. What's the best thing? Fire damage added to spells. I don't think I have fire damage to spells. I also don't think I have increased fire damage. So I don't have anything good. So do I do damage over time? This one? How about this one? Damage over time. Can I do this one? I don't have percent fire damage on the recipe. Okay. Yeah, I always go with the lower one because I'm trying to actually simulate what I could do on a real run. I'm not trying to, like, super cheat. I already cheated because I used, like, two orbs of binding, but I'm trying to not be a little cheater here. So, uh, how was your guys' day? I'm just uh, over here holding down shield charge.
So at the beginning of the map, you cast do you cast Blood Rage once, and you cast Blood Rage once, and you cast Righteous Fire, and then you just charge around, and when you get to an elite, you cast Flammability once, and then you just spam traps. Is that what you do? Okay, did I do both of the quests here? There was two things that you had to do here, right? Did I do both of them? Eventually you drop flammability. I heard from quite a few people that they made the league mechanic better, is that true? When they fixed it, did a lot of people go back to the season or were people so mad that they, like, initially that they just quit? Or did people go back? Jesus, how many fucking dead ends are there? God damn it, man. Jesus Christ. Oh. This must be part of the vision. It's got dual res, but no fire res. Okay, that's why I didn't have the fire damage. Travel to the docks. Wait, okay, I was right. God, I knew it, man. 
I knew I was missing something in the docks. Tread carefully, exile. I don't understand, though. What exactly did I miss here? Missed something somewhere. Is it this way? No. <laughs> Welcome to POE. Oh, thank you. This is the best league ever for SSF. I like that. You have that. Goodbye, not a cockroach. You guys going? Burn them down, boys. <clears throat> Colossal life last. Now this guy might kill me, but I have massive fire res though. This guy's fire damage for breakfast. Chaos orb, okay. That's a chrome, right? Three passive points, I should probably spend them. Uh go here, 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 right? One for elemental damage. Uh, yeah, Pox, if I, if I have any questions, I'll definitely call you, man. I appreciate it. Your guide is godly. I, I don't know if I've ever felt this powerful this early. My movement is godly. Uh, my only death is just because I just face tanked a boss. I would have never died if I would have just played. My guy feels like a god, honestly. And I'm sure I did some things wrong. Yeah, I mean, now I can see why beginners really like this. There's... No buttons to press, and you just win. You don't do anything. It's fucking great. I love doing nothing. Oh, you're teaming up with DM later and going hardcore? Yeah, if I get comfortable with this, I might try it and make it in hardcore and see if I can live. What does the first lab give me? Something godly or what? Something something fire related? Something about stacking fire res? Guessing? Mm. 
you just get all your fire res applies to all resistances or something. Is that a thing? Uh, I definitely want your filter, yes. Are you watching my stream, Pox? Can you post a link to your filter? Yeah, I'll use your filter for sure. I'm not even using a filter, I'm just playing. But I, I need a filter. I'll use your filter for sure. Oh, Pox just raided me? What a god. Karamon, what's up, buddy? By the way, Karamon, I think I made a decision. I think I'm going to go back to that detonate dead build that we made at some point. I think I was being way too much of a bitch. I gave up on it way too quickly. I think we need to try it again. I didn't make that whole character to do nothing with it. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not even saying that. I'm just saying we, we, need, we need to go back to it. We need to. Oh, I definitely have more fun with this. There's no doubt about that. But, oh, yeah, this is more fun. But it's not always about fun. It's about winning. And it's also about learning. All right, Pox, just give this to me. Pox, thanks for the raid, man. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Campaign filter 1 to 70 follow. Righteous fire end game. I like that. I'm just going to follow all of them. Easy. Okay, so now, is it already here? Okay. Where did my... The campaign filter won't let me follow it, though. Why not? Why can't I falter his... Why can't I follow his campaign filter? That, this is the one I want. What happened? The only thing that I can't follow... Copy it? Okay. Copy. Okay. S and then do, what do you hit? Submit? I just hit... What do I do? It requires to be T3 T sub to his OnlyFans. Okay. And now I have a copy of... Why can't I copy his? It's dumb. That's what I want, right? Thanks, man. Thanks for the raid. Thanks for the build. Thanks for the filter. Can you uh, also do my taxes? And can you just come over here and stream for me, too? What else can you do for me? Thanks, man. I appreciate it. I mean, it doesn't hurt to ask. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take.
Okay, so I'm gonna fight this boss with no lightning res. This is gonna be funny. Isn't this piety with lightning stuff? My lightning res is very bad, isn't it? Oh, 32? I mean, that's better than I thought it was. Last time I checked, I had 11. I don't know how I don't know how I gained any lightning res, but You've done your ancestors proud, now, Get purity of elements. I just wanted to give piety a chance. So I figured I would uh I mean, she's getting barbecued here. Where'd she go? I don't know, man. She's getting pretty barbecued. Where, Where is she? You stop running from me. Yeah, no chance. Okay. Well, that was very easy. Okay, get purity of elements, he said. Okay, let's go get that. Wherever he is. Have you guys ever tried this build? At least early game. This build seems to rule. Either of my flasks do anything? I love that. I don't really don't even know why. I don't even know why I have. I don't even know why I have uh, mana flasks. I pretty much never run out of mana. Put away all of this. Uh, so this amulet's not very good, right? Spell damage doesn't help me. It's strong in all content. That's what I like to hear. Alright, what are we doing? Here we go... Uh, I assume we're going to go for that node? Or, let me see. He goes down. He goes down like this. And then... Okay, let's do that. Okay, I like that. Goodbye, exile. Okay, yeah, I just made these. Fire trap, trap and mine. Fire trap, trap and mine. Life tap, swift affliction. Okay, so let's fix that. So now we can do... Do I have another life tap? I can just buy another one, but I thought I had... Yeah. I don't know what trap in mine does. And then, what do you say? Swift something? Swift assembly? This? And then he said I can get purity of elements. I think that's a blue... Is that a blue aura? Okay. Like that. The nice thing about having such insane regen is you can just life tap everything, right? Swift affliction. Okay, I got I brought the wrong. Level thirty-one. Okay. Thank you. I don't know where to go now. The Imperial Gardens. That here. <clears throat> Welcome everybody from Pox to stream. I don't know anything about this game. Bossa OCB 
the angst guy phase. Thank you so much for the subs, guys. My uh, terribleness at, at this game is going to be very, very obvious here soon. Wasn't already obvious. F fire and ignite resistant. That is exactly what we didn't want to see. What? I clicked it! Okay, I don't need the library. Later on, that resistant mod doesn't even work, so you just you just win no matter what. They can't even they can't even stop you that way. I remember you. T I remember when we were talking about it a couple weeks ago. You told me about that. It just sets it always to minus twenty. Okay, I don't need the library, right? I don't need the library and I don't need the trial. You love the one... Didn't they say they... The... POE guy said he's going to change it, right? That's something that they're adjusting. But yes, the uh, loot range here is... I mean, I think the only way to describe it is completely unacceptable. Like, they need to deposit the items into your rectum in order to pick them up. We don't want rectum items. can make a really good one to two blue. Okay. Mine isn't even good, so I should have picked it up for sure. So when I get this waypoint, I'm going to go do the lab, right? 31. Okay, makes sense. You stand before the gates of the Lord's Labyrinth. Within these walls, the Lady Goddess is watching. can take the 50 life mastery. Okay, I see. I think most builds that I've ever played take that early. I kind of wonder why you have to reset the aura every zone. It's not that big of a deal.
Yeah, I need to write. Yes, I need to. I need to, um. Get that fourth link into Righteous Fire. You were born for this. Only one of your lessons was completed, Ascendant. Okay, so I need to f I need to figure out a way to get that. I thought I wasn't even a high enough level for the burning damage, but now I think I am. Oh man, dude, I have to do a, I have to do a puzzle. Wee! I don't want to do a puzzle. Wee! I don't want it. Can I just jump in the fire? Good. Dude, I was born to stand in the fire, man. My life regen is too high, right? For the and I have massive fire res, so they just can't even do anything to me. I'll take a portal scroll, why not? I'm playing the Chieftain, yes sir. I don't know where to go. Well, not that way. Rip. Ow. An aspirant can afford to be promising. An emperor must keep a throne on his most devious trap of them all. What is this witchcraft? It's righteous fire, man. It's Pox's build, man. Before I ascend, check 67 and 52. Uh, um, uh, mm. I was going to say, that's what I was going to ask. Can I just quality righteous fire? So I'm going Chieftain, right? Chieftain. And then I pick, let's see, which one? Let's see here. We're going to pick the top right one. Modifiers to fire resistance also apply. Like that. Aha! <laughs> Hell yeah. I like that. It's a beautiful thing. Okay.
Okay, so let's see. Let's see if I can make my guy better now. Yeah, you just pick fire res every time. Okay, so let's see here. So what I need is... I need... Blue, 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 red. Um, okay. Maybe I can chrome this. I don't have any chromes is the problem, though. I got three chromes. All right, let's just send it. Watch this one, boys. Wah. Wah. Close. Is it better to use burning damage instead of efficacy? What if I did burning damage instead of efficacy? Is that a thing? Does life tap do anything with righteous fire? Okay, so you think the best option here with the four link with the red is actually life tap? I would have never guessed that. Hello. But you're you're the god, not me. I would have never guessed that ever. I'll be honest with you, I would have never even thought of it. I would have never even th I would have never even thought about it. Okay. Long day. The job never ends. Okay. I don't even know how you figured that out. That's pretty. Wait, is this what we want? This is what we want now. I can wear it. Lit. All right, so now, now we should be frying. So now, shouldn't I make these do something? Like anything? Like that? Dude, is my guy a god now, or what? Okay, he said I could take a life mastery. So I have a life tap for shield charge. I have that already. Which one needs to be level one? Shield charge or life tap? Life tap needs to be level one. Hail okay, so only the life tap on shield charge needs to be level one. I could have just switched it, you're right. Like that. Okay, Pox wants to talk to me. Let's talk to him for a second. Yo, hey, how are you doing? What's up, man? Great. How are you? Nice, nice. Okay, so here's this weird interaction. So 
you have life tap in your RF and on your fire trap, right? If you hover over it, you'll notice that obviously when the gem levels up, the damage goes up, right? But if you pay attention to a leveled life tap versus an unleveled life tap, you'll notice a leveled life tap takes more life to spend. So just look at them side by side. Does that make sense? Makes sense. So when you use a level one life tap on shield charge, every time you shield charge, you will trigger life tap versus having to shield charge like six times. The reason this is important is RF by itself, if you turn it on in your hideout, will not trigger life tap. So take a look and turn on your RF right now. You'll notice there is no life tap buff at the top. I'm not sure if you have that disabled or not, but here's a, here's a cool example. Put the level one life tap in your shield charge and look at your RF's damage at the bottom on the tooltip. Tell me what the burning says. Okay, so... You it mean... says 2,600. Yeah, right there. 26, so, yeah. Okay. Yep. So put life tap in your shield charge, shield charge one or two times, and then look at the tooltip again. I see what's happening, but I don't under, I just don't understand why. Okay, so happening. now let me explain. So yeah. you want leveled life taps on your fire trap. And basically anything that does damage, you want a leveled life tap. When you proc life tap with your shield charge, anything that is using the life tap support gem is now in effect. Without the life tap buff, the life tap support gem is not doing anything other than making it cost life. I understand. So you use shield charge just to activate life tap and then yes. it 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 buffs it on all the skills that actually exactly. needed to do damage. Yep, that's uh, exactly it. Later on you will have multiple life taps cuz you're going to like you're going to have like your flammability uh which will later swap the punishment that'll be life tap too. So to to like save gems in the future, you can do like shield charge faster attacks, life tap, flammability. And that's like a four link, right? And they're both sharing one life tap. And that's exactly what I have right now. That exact four layers. Oh, that's right perfect. Here. That's literally perfect. Yeah, there you go. Yep. It's like a very unique interaction. Like, has this been known for a, like, how did people even figure that out? You want to know how we figured it out? Because I've been playing RF for like seven years. And back in the day, there were literally not enough support gems to work for the skill. Like there just didn't exist enough support gems. That's so we started, <laughs> we started trying with different things. So we tried originally with arcane surge and we learned that and i this is kind of like some weird deep stuff here um you basically if a skill has like a vol gem version and the vol gem is different for example vol righteous fire has a hidden duration tag because it only lasts for a few seconds by putting in the support gem arcane surge it tags a secret duration tag to rf enabling it to scale with duration based support gems which you will then use swift affliction later so it's something unique without life tap you can't use swift affliction with rf with life tap you can use swift affliction okay so this is one of those this is one it's of not those. like a bug it's a it, it's been in the game for so long they've never touched it <laughs> it's just a weird thing right like other builds use it for different things it's just it's just PoE, man. I mean, that, that's kind of interesting. It's like some tribal knowledge kind of thing that you would only figure that out after trying it, trying every single thing, or as you said, having no options, and you just yep. test everything and come up with this crazy interaction. Yep. Huh. I can appreciate that. That's actually pretty sick. I would have never thought of that. That's I, why I, I wanted to jump and call because like there are some parts that unless you like watch my videos, it's just confusing. Yeah. Yeah, I I definitely if I would have just read that you're putting life tap on righteous fire, I would have been like, there's yeah, no like, way, why? right? There's got to be something better. Also, you're going backwards in this area if you care. Oh, yeah. Uh, toxic. I, al I always do that. Always. I get the waypoint and then I go backwards. And then you go backwards, yeah. Yeah, you gotta look for the stairs that say upper, right? Mm hmm You could probably just portal, go back to your waypoint, and then exactly. just take the other. Yeah. And then go the other way. Yeah. Literally any question you have, ask me. I will be more than happy to answer all day long. I don't know what's wrong with me. I love helping people. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. 
You're a god. This, this build's really fun. I can see why so many it people is. play I it. I wanted to help you with Act 1, because Act 1 looked a bit frustrating. To the trick with Act 1 on Marauder, you get Goat Horn ones, which give you a little bit of flat fire. They're like 2 to 4 flat fire. Rolling Magma has really high damage effectiveness. So when you shoot the Rolling Magma through a Flame Wall and you have two Goat Horns, even if they're white, it's usually enough damage to one-shot a pack and blue packs die in like two hits. Yeah. But like without knowing that, you know, Caster Marauder is very awkward for sure. Yeah, I've, uh, I used to hate Rolling Magma. Like I couldn't stand it, but then I had to level as it like a couple of times and I'm like, all like right. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. And I was like, okay, I, I can see why people use this. Like, you get used to it. But I think, like, brand new people probably despise that skill. Yeah, well, that's why I have, like, a six-hour campaign video that I do an SSF character and show, like, how to level the whole build. But I saw you in using it as well. I had an option for people who don't like it or in conjunction with it, you can use the Holy Flame Totem setup where you do Holy Flame Totem added fire summon phantasm. The Flame Totem kills... It, they both benefit off of the added fire, and the phantasms can even shoot into the flame wall. I, I that's one thing that I always never understood. It's like it seems like the holy flame totem early game is very powerful. It is. It seems like it just fries, it, especially in conjunction with flame wall, because the flame wall just adds like basically a support gem or two to every skill that can fire through the flame wall. At least in Path of Exile. Flat damage is king early. Like, percentages don't matter until you have base damage, right? Right. So right. when you get things that give you base damage, everything starts to kind of pop off. The Touch of God might one-shot you here, by the way. It's very heavy physical. All right. I think it's 50 fizz, 50 light. It might just flatten me here. You could try tanking it if you want. Say no more. We're tanking it. Did you get the life mastery? I did. Okay. 1k life. That's pretty decent. You could open up a portal just in case, right? Dude, I dude, I hate that that's a mechanic in this game, man, if I'm being honest. I, I'll be honest. I'm not a big fan of it either. And this is why I play very tanky builds even in softcore, because I don't enjoy portal cheesing content, right? I prefer to have a build that can, even if the boss fight takes 30 minutes instead of three, I get a lot more satisfaction by knowing that I worked for the kill. Yeah, I, I, they're getting rid of that in PoE 2, right? Yes, PoE 2, you die, you retry the fight. Well, I, well, no, no, no. You can portal in a boss fight, but it has a cast time, I believe. And it can be interrupted, if I am correct. So, But you can portal out of it. I think so. Okay. But it's like punishing, not like... Not like PoE now, where you just open up a portal and click the button. He hit me with a big slam, and it actually did zero damage to me. I don't know I if think I you, blocked it. You blocked, blocked it. yeah. You blocked the shield. You mean just block five head? Yep. That's what's nice about wearing a shield. You get some innate block chance. It's like dodging an Uber Lilith ghost at the end. The and damage? He died in two seconds. The damage really picks up on the build in the campaign. I will tell you straight up, your damage will not stay like this. Like when you get to yellow maps, your damage will start to fall off. But the build is designed to be a very good map clear build. So you will, have you ever had explode mechanics? You ever use like Oriat's End on your tornado shot build from the other league? Uh, It's not sounding familiar. Okay, then you're going to love it when you get it. I mean, I like it when things explode. Oh, it explodes all right. <laughs> you showed me the clip, right, where it's like the chain reaction. Is that what you're talking about? You that won't thing? get that until, like, I'll call it mid-game in SSF, but you can absolutely get that in SSF. That requires one other mechanic. So the Chieftain Ascendancy node that you will take on M Merciless Lab, oh, sorry, the third lab, is the explode node and it gives a 5% chance when you kill something that that monster explodes. The difference is you've played or you've read like detonate dead, right? Things like that. I think it's chat. What is DD's corpse health scaling? Is it like 6%? It's like a small amount, but it's enough to kill stuff. Chieftain's explode node is 500% of the corpse <laughs> life. 
you, what's going to happen is you're going to map and you're going to come across a map boss and there will be a couple of map bosses where there's a pack of mobs right next to the boss and you explode the pack and the boss gets one shot and it's gone and that will just stay and then later you will amplify it and this is why i love chieftain because as your build becomes tankier stronger and you get more damage your clear only elevates with that because the chieftain explode node scales with the content you're running so pretty much you start having a ton of fun and you just start bombing everything. You really do have so much fun, yeah. There are, there's one thing specifically for Chieftain you need to elevate it, and it will be a chase to get an SSF because it's, it's RNG, but it's not like it's anything crazy rare. Like, every build is going to want this stuff at some point. Are you familiar with Searing Exarch and Eater of Worlds? I know, I know the I know the names of the bosses. I couldn't okay. tell you what You know those Ickers? The little Ickers? You ever have to pick them up oh. and you do the altars? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so... Exarch Altars, the tier of the currency does not matter, can be the lowest ember. When you use it on your build, I don't know, actually, I don't remember if it's either Exarch, I think it's Exarch. Chat is it Exarch? You can get ignites you inflict uh, basically are in a circle and they last for like five seconds. So when you explode a monster and it rolls an ignite, your 500% damage ignite is now in a circle and that can allow it to chain. Because rather than just the initial hit triggering another explode, you have this proliferation where mobs can walk into and it can change. What do you think, like, the full endgame potential of this build is? Do you think in SSF I have any chance of killing any of the Ubers with this? No. That's not because of the build, per se. There's two reasons for this. Number one, they made Ubers way more difficult to access in SSF now because you actually have to clear tier 17 content, kill the tier 17 bosses, get the fragments, and then do that. However, what I will tell you about Chieftain is for SSF, for me, it's like a 9 out of 10, if not 10 out of 10 map farmer. So you can absolutely farm any anything you want for another build designed for bossing. Another really cool thing about this build is if you ever like playing multiple builds, it's kind of a weird one because you can run reflect mods. You take no reflect damage. So you can run physical reflect, you can run um, elemental reflect. So if you ever make another character, there's a good chance that they they work together because they get countered by different things. So you start off with this, you farm a bunch of gear and currency, then you switch to whatever is the best boss or level it up real quick, and then that's it? That's typically the meta. That's not like the RF build specifically, but that's usually meta for SSF, is you find the budget bosser that doesn't need anything crazy because Ubers and Path of Exile are really no joke. Like, compared to regular pinnacle bosses, they are absolutely no joke. You can kill them, it's just this patch specifically, unfortunately, was the big patch for redoing how you access Ubers. Can this build kill the regular non-Uber version of the boss? Absolutely. You can 100% get your uh, four Void Stones on this. Your first two, you can do in life res gear. Nothing special. Um, your second two, which are Maven and Uber Elder. I am very biased. I love Maven with Righteous Fire. Most of the community hates it because there is a scenario in the last phase where there are beams you need to dodge. And if you get hit by a beam, it turns off your regeneration for 10 seconds. You can just, you specifically for that fight, you will bring in a life flask that removes burning. So if you get hit by it, you just press your flask, you wait, and then you can fight again. You can still fight with fire trap anyway. And to be fair, the beam also reduces all forms of recovery. It's not just life regen, so other builds do get affected by it a lot. Okay, I, I really, I have, I have killed the four bosses before. But I had such a powerful build, and it was so long ago. I literally don't know. I know Maven you has a, everything. Yeah, I, I know Maven has like a Simon Says kind of thing, and I know yes. one of them throws fireballs, but I just have no idea what they even do. So here's my opinion on my build. I think it is one of the best builds you can play, no bias, for learning entry-level boss fights. And the reason being, you are not reliant on your flasks for sustain, and you're not reliant on hitting the boss for leech. What this allows you to do is focus on the boss fight and learn the mechanics versus A, greeting for damage or dying, or B, 
panicking because you're out of flasks. Yeah. That sounds logical to me. Okay, the, your loot filter really likes this thing that dropped. Oh, yeah, that's just saying it's a four link. It's like colors for fire trap. You don't care about that, though. That turquoise amulet's sick. Turquoise amulet is a dex int base, which is what you are starved for in the early mid. Actually, like pretty much forever. God, speaking of starving, God, I wish I had some tacos right now. Yo, tacos and cheesecake for dessert. Why don't we eat the same thing? Dude, cheesecake for dessert. Oh, oh yeah, well, we already had this talk. I was like, we did, did. Yeah. How did you pick the two most perfect things? I love tacos, man. This guy, this guy is a god. Doesn't even have anything to do with righteous fire. I don't know. I think this is. I think this and uh, so far in Bone Zone are two of my favorites. the The reason why I like this build, it's not even the fact that I'm doing nothing. It's that you can spend a hundred percent of your time just focusing on move speed. Just dash, yes. dash, 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 dash. Yes. Port, 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 port. It's great. People like don't value movement speed enough. So, do you know how Frost Blink works? By the way, that you can animation cancel shield charge with Frost Blink. Uh. So. I think Karaman and other people were explaining this to me. Like, you're supposed to start shield charging and then frost blink to cancel the animation. You cancel the end animation. This is only for speed running. You don't really care about that, like, for general play. The more important thing is, you know, say you're running a map that is, like, all hallways. And at the end of a hallway is a shrine and there's, like, 57 skelly mages blasting you. And you shield charge. You're now locked into that shield charge. With frost blink, you could interrupt your shield charge and reposition yourself behind the shrine and all the mobs are now shooting in front of you no other movement skill is like that because they have a tiny bit of delay so you have to wait for the shield charge to end then the movement skill goes off so if you're like really fast you can shield charge swing your mouse the opposite direction and then frost blink where you came from and it will end the shield charge it's very nice okay so yeah that seems like seems like almost a requirement at that point yeah, because you're playing a melee build. You really want as much mobility as you can possibly get. Okay. So you shield... So the, the basic idea of it is you shield charge, and at the end of your shield charge, you don't wait for the animation. You cancel it with Frost Blink. Yeah, for if you're just trying to go fast, yes. That's a nice four link, actually. God, I should pick that up. Okay, man. Did you say later on you're going to play with DM? Yeah, I'm not in a rush, so he still has, like, I think two hours till he's back. We're actually both playing Bone Zone right now in the campaign. He's Jug and I'm Slayer. You, are you hardcore, or? Yeah, we're hardcore. Just All going right. at a nice pace, you know, just nice and simple. Are you going to play uh, No Rest for the Wicked? I have to look <clears> at it again. I heard very good things about it. Well, uh, so I played the early access of it, um, played the first act. Mm -hmm. uh, so I have never played a Dark Souls game. Have you played one? Not really. I played a little bit of, I think, Dark Souls 2. It was like years ago. And then I played a little bit of Elden Ring, but just for like maybe 10 hours. And that was it. Okay, so I've never, I've literally never played one, not even for one second. But I know about them, right? The whole idea is super hard bosses. Um, yeah, don't get hit. Don't get hit. So um, I tried it, and they're, it, they said it's like an ARPG meets Dark Souls, which I think is literally true. But what what it really is is it's a Dark Souls game. Um, Got it. The, the very first white rat that you fight killed me three times. Oh the, wow! One white. I'm, it's not exactly. That's a very, very different pace from an ARPG. It's it's, it's very, very, very hard. Um, I so, like that though. It's fun. Yeah. So it's like on the first rat, you're gonna stop and be like, "All right, I need to understand the mechanics. I need to understand timing. I need to understand parry, block, dodge." Um, you are. There is no such thing as doing. You know what I'm doing right here. Just teleporting forward one shotting everything right um like a i i'm sure people will get to the point right when they this happens in every game where they're just going to be farming everything but on your first playthrough every white mob is like a boss fight 
Um, so, like, in the entire first act, I think I killed maybe at the most 20 monsters. Like, wow. if, if you, if you yeah. pull two monsters at a time, it's like old school, old school, like, warrior pulling two monsters, like, you're dead. Right. Like, there's nothing you can do to get away or whatever. That's definitely very much like Dark Souls-like versus ARPG. I like whenever there's a different change of pace, to be honest, in games. Like, playing a similar genre, but I guess this one is not necessarily similar genre, but it sounds fun. Yeah, so it comes out uh, in three days. So that might be one you want to check out. For sure. Very much so. It's it's going to be tough. Our, our rectums are never going to feel the same. Guys, we, we, you're not supposed to use your skill points. Pox told me. I'm saving them for later. We can actually... Um, you want to do more damage or do you want to swap to be more tanky? I just want to do more damage, man. You want to do more damage? Oh, okay. Let's see. Flash your tree for me after this kill. You know, you don't even need to look at the screen. You can just flash I'm it right now. I, I'm, I'm literally just doing your build. Exactly copying it. I just I just got the three nodes for the elemental damage and I'm moving my way up. Okay, so you're going up, so that means you're gonna get holy fire next. I have different ways that I path based off of how my character feels at the time. It's always hard to make a really static POB that doesn't change. Yeah, I uh as a guide writer of many, many games, I know what you mean. Like you yep. try to make something universal, and then people say, Rax, I did what you said, but I have this terrible problem. It's like, well, if you have that terrible problem, then do this to fix it. Yeah, but why didn't you tell me that? Well, I. do you want me to make 300 different versions of my build? Or... So this scepter has 32% fire damage, added fire damage, and elemental damage on it. Is that so good? Here's a funny thing. So all scepters have Ellie base except for one weird one. The added fire doesn't do anything. Anything that says to spells doesn't do anything. But the fire damage in general is good. Can you hold alt on it? See if there's an affix open. Uh, something, something, something. It's still better than yours. I would just use it. Lit. You didn't get cast speed, which is not bad for uh, your curse. So, uh, yeah, it has cast speed on it. Um... So is Righteous Fire, people universally tell me that you never look at a tooltip in PoE because it's always wrong. Like wrong. Er they're wrong with this with this one. Th and that's what I was going to ask is is like if I compared the two, uh, all things being held equal, if I compared the tooltip on Righteous Fire, would that actually tell me early yes. game which one was? Yes, better? it would. Yes. OK, I'll I'll hear before you continue on. I gave you a little message here in Discord. Copy that whole thing. Put it into a vendor and paste it. It will highlight anything that's a four link. So if you find like an armor ES or a pure energy shield helmet, you can buy it out and color it. I have, even... I have 10 orbs of binding. Oh, you have 10 orbs of binding. Okay, let's get you a new helmet then. So if you see a pure energy shield helmet, buy it. Make sure it's like white though, unless you have scours. Okay, um... Yeah, I don't think so, I see anything. Don't see one here. Does anybody else sell helmets? Uh, you can go back to the previous act and check because what the binding is going to do is it will override the item level and guarantee that it's four linked. Okay. I don't know. So it, is it clear in regards to the tooltip, I'll give a little explanation as to why this is true and not true while you're doing the helmet stuff. So because Righteous Fire is very niche, it doesn't scale with penetration, which will typically not apply on the tooltip. You cannot apply like minus res to it, so that's not on the tooltip. It cannot be scaled with crit, so it won't get inflated by crit multi when you have no crit chance, right? And it does not scale with attack or cast speed, which means like, again, the fluctuation is literally just raw damage. There's no way to change the tick rate, so it's literally just damage. So in the comparison, it's always accurate. The only time it will get a little bit wonky are two scenarios. Number one, the first scenario, you can actually buy that if you wanted, the int one that you were looking at. The only which, downside which one, with an int. The bone circlet or the tribal? 
the there was a body armor up there. I think that's a four link uh, blue, 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 red. The only downside with that, which is still worth using, is it has no armor, so you might feel a little squishier, but you'll get your links online right away. Should I alk it? Um, you can alk it, or if you have an essence for fire, you have any fire essence? Which one is that? I think maybe anger? It's like greenish looking. I don't remember if anger is also fire res. Okay, now you can just alk it. Yeah. It's the worst thing ever. Should I scour an alk again? I mean, no, you have suffix open. You can just craft fire res if you want. Like crafting fire res if suffix is open would be good, and then it gives life regen. And then you just need the int for it. And in fact, actually, I guarantee I can almost guarantee you that when you open up your passive tree, you're getting more int right now. So we're going. This is how I designed way, right? it. Yeah. Uh, let me see once it loads. Yeah, so the next node yep. is int. Yeah, you're going int, 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 I think. Three points of int in a row. I like that. And then holy fire should be on the left. And you want to take the fire multi one, not chance to ignite. Like that? Yes, just like the perfect. Yep. So that and so now we do we drop life tap here? Uh, yeah, you swap life tap for burning. Did you get dicked by int again? Or do you mean efficacy? Or we had burning already. So you're gonna draw. So you no, those, those links are perfect. The way you have them. Yeah, you got righteous fire, elemental focus, efficacy, and burning damage. Yes. Yep. And then when you kill Malachi. You have the choice of dropping efficacy for ink AoE for more AoE. Okay, and you do need some int on your body armor, I can see. Wait, what happened? Oh, it's got to be a gem, right? Uh, or... I don't know. The alternative option is just crafting Wait. intelligence on one piece of gear. Or your amulet. Actually, yeah, let me look at your amulet. What do you have there? You have a Dex amulet. You have the what is that turquoise amulet in your inventory there? Should I craft fire res on it and wear it instead? Yeah, before you craft on it, make sure when you equip it, your dexterity is okay. If it's not, look at your blood rage because sometimes blood rage is a big, uh, big dex sink, and you don't need a ton of a lot of stuff. Can okay. I should I just blood buy a level rage. one blood rage then? Yeah, but now your boots and your other piece is off. So let me see where you can craft. It's, this gets a little bit better later because there's a big 30 dex node you can get. Uh, let me take this. You need like 60 dex. How much do you have right now? 54. So I only need, I only, I only need six dex. Okay, and, so and here's like a can stuffed I just craft, solution. Can I just craft decks on my amulet sure. since it's all Yeah, you can do end? that. Yep, yep, you can do that. Not a problem. Oh, I'm stupid. I, I, I said I said the right thing, but I did the wrong thing. There we go. It happens. There we go. I was like, craft decks, and then I crafted int. So now you you want to try to not swap your amulet unless you're getting basically an int base. Dex base will be more valuable or turquoise, which is ideal. You can even buy turquoise out of the shop and just alk it and then like potentially get a better one as you go on. Okay. Okay, so now we finally have both of the correct four links and... Yep. So now what you get to do you can actually swap your helmet to a pure armor helmet so you can get some armor back since you're wearing pure energy shield on your body armor. Okay, let's see what the Act 4 vendor has. And then if you're buying a white helmet, make sure you put four armor scraps on it so you get 20% quality. So this one then, the required level 35, 182? Yeah, that one's good. The only downside is it is blue, so you'd have to scour it. 
and the other one's level seven, so the base is kind of crappy. If you have a scour, you can go for that on that. It would be not bad. It, it would give you a lot of armor. And then binding it? Yeah. yeah quality, quality at first, it. though? Yep. yep. Quality and then binding. Life fire res, but it's only three lives, so that's dog shit. I mean, so, uh, let's see. Hold alt. Is that a, is there a block and stun recovery life fiber? I don't think there is. No. Okay. Um, go to your hideout. You might be able to craft, uh, you can craft like flat armor and it'll still be okay. The thing is, what's interesting about RF, it's okay if you don't have a ton of life rolls on your gear right now. It's actually like potentially good because you're brute forcing RF with flat regen. You have very little percent regen right now. So you need to keep your life around like an okay level. Later on, you won't have to worry about this because you'll have way more regeneration. Okay. Perfect. Now, I, I assume we're going to be just deleting you everything should, now. Yeah, you should be rolling. You might just have to put your auras back on and you think you're good. And then you want to drop those MP flasks for like a ruby and a granite and or a quartz whenever you're able to get them. I really appreciate it, man. Thanks for pimping out my character. No problem. PoE can be frustrating because it's hard to troubleshoot when everything's wrong and you don't know where to start. You know, you pull off one piece of gear and you're like, hmm. <sighs> All right, man. Well, thanks for all your help. I'll probably be tuning in to you and DM later. I'll probably be watching you guys blast on hardcore, especially if you're playing Bone Zone, right? Yeah, yeah. We're very, very new into the campaign right now. We're like Act 4, maybe Act 5. That's going to be good content. It'll be fun. It'll be like, I think, an hour and a half. Ta -ta. All right, man. Well, thanks again for everything. Thanks for the raid. Thanks for uh, making great builds, man. It's fun. Not a problem, dude. I will catch you later. Anytime you have a question, you just shoot me a DM, friend. All right, man. Go get some tacos. All right. See you later, dude. Later. Guys, that was Pox, ladies and gentlemen. Brax loves flasks and flask management. Yeah, I really do. That's so fun. Wait, I'm getting frenzy charges? What am I getting frenzy charges from? Is that blood rage? Blood rage. Put my aura on. Yeah, okay. One of my auras turned off. Thank you. I don't ever press left click. I'll put... Let me put it to movement, though, so people don't ask me about it. Good point, good point. But I, I don't ever press left click. No left click was ever pressed on this stream. Yeah, like le as in left click is not even my is not even my movement. I don't even move with left click. I press left click to go through a door. That's it. Other than that, I never press it ever. Yeah, if you were if you were ever a Diablo 3 challenge rifter, you would learn that you can never win a challenge rift ever if you moved with left click. Because the final the final time is gonna come down to the last half second. And you will not be able to make that up if you move with left click. It's just too slow. You have to force move. If you don't force move, you will never win. It's just that simple. I'm doing very, very good on my exercise and weight loss journey. 
This morning I woke up, I went on a walk, and I played with the dog, and I ate nothing. I'm getting a lot of... I'm getting a lot of, uh... Uniques here. I force move with mouse five, yeah. Another unique? Why do I keep getting so many uniques? Streamer filter, streamer uniques. Ow, that didn't feel good. Rude. Is that another unique? Are, are you serious? It, it is, more than you is this for real? How many uniques did I just get? I just got four uniques in one map. What's up? Life, life. It's got to be better than mine, right? Maybe I can even craft uh, fire res on it. Oh, you got to take it out of the thing, right? you doing are you hungry what what do you want to eat what do you want I was thinking we could order my favorite food dick how do you feel about dick for lunch <laughs> Huh? 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 Dick, guys. Dick. Don't pretend like that's not your favorite. The way to a god's heart is through its guts. I cannot do this yet. What do you want for for lunch? Brine King and Ralakesh, okay. Yeah, Brine King is can't be frozen. Ralakesh is Is that the moving moving while bleedy boy or is that the Bernie boy? We can get whatever you want for lunch, so. <laughs> yeah, dick is usually toasted.
Yeah, dick is a good source of protein. No, that's a myth. Oh. People have been overvaluing the protein you get from dick. Well, that's upsetting. Got to supplement it with a protein shake. Okay, wait, is this the person that we don't curse? We don't... Do we not curse? We don't curse the fatty or what? Okay, so this is Chevron gas station. Chevron gas station down. But isn't that going to be all the shitty furniture that nobody wants, though? Did I just take away half of his health when he wasn't even playing? This is softcore. Um, I've never played this build before, so I wanted to practice on softcore SSF, but... Uh, too lazy to read. I need one of these, Summon Stone Golem, I believe it is, right? Summon Stone Golem.
Can I jump this? Sometimes can't always get what we want, boys. Uh, Sukiko, did I say that right? Thank you so much for the sub, man. Appreciate that. Um, I like Righteous Fire a lot. This is definitely the build that you should play as a new player. It's definitely this one. If you enjoy doing nothing like me. I mean, this is me just starting. I just started. This is definitely what you should play, Sarah. This is going to be your favorite build ever in any in any game. You just do nothing. Stand dead. It's godly. It's fun. I can help you build it if you want on your stream. Hello. Forgot the. Forgot one step. This has fire res and life on it and dex. So maybe we replace this one. I just started, but I am level 39. What? It's not a five link. It's got five sockets, but it only has four links. This is this will definitely be your favorite build in Path of Exile by far. You will love this. The, the quality of life here is incredible. You just you're pretty much invincible. You have cap resistances by doing nothing. You kill everything by doing nothing, and it's super fast. This build has everything. I don't even spend mana, really. Yes, I'm reserving a ton of my mana. Because I don't need it. It's not like super powerful in the end game, but you can use it to like clear all the maps and stuff. And then once you're really, really rich, then you can just build like a really, really good bosser and go fight the bosses. The only buttons I'm pressing right now are just my movement skills. I'm not attacking in any way. And look, everything's just dying. Just that aura around me. See that fire aura? Just kills everything. All I'm doing is running around. That's it. Okay, this guy is super tanky. Ow. And then he exploded on me. That's what she said. Going. I mean, you just don't pay any attention to the monsters. You just walk. Monsters aren't important enough to pay attention. Here's a boss. Look, just running a circle around him. Just running a circle. He's dead. I did nothing. What? I can't. What? Yeah. 
Oh yeah, so he's saying you I think he's saying you can make your AoE the the ring of fire bigger instead of a certain gem just to make it so you hit everybody everywhere. I think if you made this build, you'd want to play PoE all day. You just mow everything down. It's fun. It's pretty. It's like what? It's like water ally Ina Monk. Comparable, yes. It's like that. That's a good comparison. It's like the Ina Monk, where you run forward and everything just dies and you don't do anything. Very comparable. It's a good way to learn the, like, the bosses, too, as Pox was explaining. When you, like, have to fight the actual real bosses in the game. This, this build is all about life regen. So if they hit me, watch my life on the left. I'm not even drinking any potions. My life will just shoot back up to full. So as long as you don't get one-shotted, you can pretty much stay... What? Oh, shit. I'm not using the right thing. I'm supposed to be in the middle. Damn it. I cannot do this yet. What? I just can't hear you when you talk at one volume. Your voice is so quiet. Still couldn't hear you. It's either it's either I'm deaf or you're the quietest talker in the universe. It's probably both. Excellent. Look at me versus this yellow. God, I'm talented. Every time I kill a boss or an elite, I'm going to say how talented I am. So much talent to exude here. Okay, here we go. Me versus this elite. God, I'm talented. God, I'm talented. Nope. The inner ring doesn't matter. Here's a bunch of mo enemy. Uh, pfft, dead. Did nothing. This is one of the best zones to level up in. We don't give a French toast about leveling up. I'm just gonna keep pressing forward here. What? <laughs> you want a giant plate of oatmeal raisin cookies. Well, at least we're keeping it healthy. I was afraid we were gonna have something bad for you. You guys don't like oatmeal raisin cookies? I would say oatmeal raisin cookies are... Well, first of all, I actually think cookies don't have that... Like, assuming that it's a very well-made cookie, I don't think cookies have that much of a variance. Like, a chocolate... Ch a perfect chocolate chip cookie versus a perfect peanut butter cookie versus a perfect oatmeal raisin cookie versus a perfect snickerdoodle doodle cookie versus a perfect M&M cookie. I mean, they're all godly. Like, it, it really doesn't matter. Still, I would say oatmeal raisin is 
it I definitely think it's in contention for the best one. It might it might be the best cookie of them all, maybe. I, cannot do this yet. I like them all though, I mean as a certified fat ass, I like them all. What? Okay, there's got to be some kind of totem that's making them live forever or something. I don't know what's happening. Oh, they're dead now. I don't know what happened, but whatever I want. So this guy is a is a meanie head. The world must be cleansed of impurity. Let's see if this guy can kill me. Okay. Where did he go? Let's burn all of his friends. For you, oatmeal raisin is an F tier cookie. Double chocolate or white macadamia nut is better. I forgot about the macadamia nut ones. You think oatmeal raisin is F tier, huh? F tier? Do you not like oatmeal? I mean, guys, guys, when you make an oatmeal raisin cookie, don't even pretend like you can, like the raisins have hardly any taste. They're engulfed in a circular object that's like pure sugar. You can taste the texture of the raisins, but there ain't no way in hell you actually taste the raisins. Okay, I didn't like that. What was that attack? Yeah, I mean, the raisins taste like little brains in your cookie, so if you don't like the texture of brains in your cookie, I guess that makes sense. All I heard was, mmm, but I, what was the first part of that whole thing? <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> I think that every time I do that, I lose a thousand followers, but yeah, we can do it anyway. Look, it's an elite. They're dead. I don't know where I'm going. The ruined square. I don't know. It looks fine to me. Find the entrance to the ossuary. Okay, whatever you say. 
don't know where to go. Let's just go around the edge, I guess. Oh, that was the wrong way. Rip. Okay, what's this? Split! Okay, so I picked up a bunch of shit. It's probably all garbage. Let's take a look here. Elemental mana. No. 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 What a surprise. Everything sucks. Thank you. you just once remember. We do freedom comes to us. Okay, I don't know what to do. I don't know what, what what's worth anything. So when in doubt, just sell everything. So this is probably better than this. Put these two away. Hello. Sell these. Give me a reward. I mean, Ruby Flask? I mean, that's, that seems good, right? More fire res. It's got to be good. I'll never press it, but I'll put it on my bar so people are happy. Four passive points. I'm supposed to grab this. And then boink, boink. And then we're supposed to get 10% uh, less damage. 10% less damage taken from damage over time this okay whatever you say pox going for that whatever he says that's what i'm doing don't know what to do don't know what to do i'm scared a reward a jewel watch guys when you get a jewel you just sell it because it's always dog shit talk to this person give me that talk to this person okay What's the next? What? Someone is today's dad? <laughs> We're definitely going for this. 10% increased life. I love that. Pox is the new daddy. Daddy Pox. That's what we're going to call him. Daddy Pox. How am I so good? I think anybody in chat watching who has ever played PoE would unanimously agree, agree that I'm the worst player that ever played this game. Not, I'm not even being, I'm not even kidding. I am absolute garbage at this game. Wish I was good, but I'm not. Okay, we got a yeller belly right here. He's dead. Can I have my reward yet? Jesus. There, thank you. Jesus. Should have got that scroll of wisdom, oh well. He's I'm in the top a hundred worst. Okay, well. It's a better ranking than I thought I was gonna get. There's ninety-nine people out there worse than me. That makes me feel good. Okay, me versus this yellow. We'll see how it goes. I won. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, this way. That yellow's just a huge waste of my time. Click this guy, give me that. Okay, I don't know what this is. Sign of purity. Uh, I don't know what to do with it. Kill Ochilla. Do I need to kill Ochilla? Guys? No. Thank you. Oh, I, I leveled it. Damn it. I wasn't supposed to do that. Thank you. 
Thank you, I'm sorry. Fuck. I was not, I wasn't supposed to level it. <sighs> Why can't I just do this? I, like the, I have the simplest tasks and I can't even do them, man. Why can't I do the, even the simplest tasks? Yeah, but I don't want to use nine scours, right? Nine scours isn't the answer. Okay, so then you right click it and then it stays at level one, right? I had one job. Rax, all you have to do is don't level life tap. First thing I do, level life tap to level 10. Awesome. I had one job. I had one job. How do I, how do I properly see where he's going to do that? Okay, I know what he's doing there. Uh, I don't know, what do, what do I do with those demon things? I'm scared. I'm guessing we just stand on the heart here. Dodge that one. That's good. Okay, dodge that one. Okay. Yep. This is the POE fist up your ass. Very, very bad in the first phase. We're gonna get the aura wheel, and then when we get that, we pick up determination. Okay, yeah, that's determination is armor, right? The flame of hope may flicker, but it cannot be extinguished. I don't know what my best time ever clear was in this game. I don't know if I've ever with Kada with Katava dead with Katava dead and all three labs done. I don't know if I have ever done it in under six hours. I think I've done it in under seven. I'm guessing 6.30 is my best time ever. Don't do this quest, I already did it. I don't have to do it. I don't have to clear the tw Twilight Strand. 
Yeah, maybe it was around. I think I've done a little bit. You only have to do it once. Okay. Is that to unlock Lily in your hideout or something? Stay out of trouble. Okay, I don't want to do Gray Peacock. Damn it. I didn't want to do Gray Peacock. Okay. Dead. Okay, they're dead. Because I, I don't like to do... I try to avoid... I try to avoid every mechanic in the campaign just so I can just get get through it. Let's see if we can do this. This is my first time playing Righteous Fire. I could do better if I went again, but... Let's see if we can do this in under uh, six and a half hours, let's say. He did this to me. The King of Brian. Let's see if we can do that. Maybe. You can post links, yeah, you can. frying here. Okay, big fight here, big fight. I won. Easy. Let's go in here. Let's level everything up. My life tap should still be level one, right? Okay, okay. Finally doing the thing. Okay, 
that. Don't know where to go. I don't need to complete the lab. Just always go around the cream fill her the edge, I mean. Orb finding is good early game. Chaos orb. Okay, I'll take that. I forgot to take the crafting recipe in the boss room. Rip. Rip. That's a win. Fire resistant. Too lazy to fight that guy. Let's curse them. Dead. Okay. Let's get into the next zone. Chevron gas station's tower. I will take that. Here. I love how it shows me the, uh, these are all blues. We kill the blues, right? That's what you're supposed to do to level up. We kill the blues. I don't know where to go. Mm. Another chouse. Is it over here? Nope. I love going all the wrong ways. I've never played Grim Dawn, but Grim Dawn 2 is coming out this year, right? So I, I definitely will. I know a lot of people really like that game. the wrong way. Let's get in here. Let's burn everything down. Chopped. Let's get in the door. Hello, Chevron gas station. For my life and my work, I shall not suffer this humiliation again. I'm talented. Is there a crafting recipe? Doesn't look like it. Take an orb of alteration. I got three passive points I'm not even using. It's kind of funny. What do we do next? We get the life. Is immense. Something that will, in all likelihood, consume my life. 
And then we start going up this way. Okay, no clue where to go. I'm just gonna follow the road. Following the road can't be the wrong thing, right? Following the road can't be the wrong thing. Okay, let's go this way. Riverways. Follow the road again. There's a blue. We killed the blues, right? There's a lot of monsters here. That guy. That guy's way too strong. So we'll just skip him. I'm a 46 and a 48. Alright, I'm two levels behind. That is probably okay though, right? Gotta be within three, right, is what they say. Big boy on me, I don't like that. Big boy is still here. Ow. Just got 100 owed. Crying. I cannot do this yet. Southern forest. Don't know where to go. So I just follow the, the outside. We just follow the edge. And okay, burn him down. Raxus, thank you so much for the prime, my friend. Appreciate you. The Prime King. His time has almost come. Then hope will be I will be gone. That has seventy one life on it. That flag. It once fluttered from the mast of the Black Crest, Wayne and Roth's ship. Throw it into the flames of the beacon. It's your only chance of reaching me. Getting Cloak of Flame is a massive improvement. <laughs> you guys are frying. Locked door, I'm crying. Okay. 
got two points I'm not using. Let's keep using the points here. Okay. Let's go like this. Let's go this way. Teleport this way. Are you hungry? Don't know where I am, don't know what I'm doing. I'm I know I missed a couple of passive points back there that we're gonna have to go get soon. Thank God the regular blue hood is back. Yeah, the uh, the other one was also a blue hoodie, but the chroma key made it look gray. But it's actually like a light baby blue. But that did not show up at all correctly yesterday. Yeah, we can. Yep, you wanna order it? Like on mine, you can literally just press reorder from last time or whatever. Ow! What, what, what is murdering me? I'm crying. Yeah, the bleeds. I am enjoying Righteous Fire. This build's fun. Yep. Does look scary. So I better be extra careful here. Whenever somebody looks scary, they almost always are. Oh, 
That didn't feel good. Let's go this way. Let's burn them down. Yes, sir, bomb. Try to get more life if I can. I'm never worth staying here with this guy, but forty eight in a fifty zone, all right. Pretty consistently keeping my so strong, so dedicated. How are my resistances? This should be super capped. Super ultima capped. A sumptuous feast for his majesty on his wedding day. That sounds good. We are both so touched by your generosity. Okay, so when he has his little water shield up, I can't stand next to him. Is that what I'm seeing? Can I TP the fa to the phase to cheese it? I don't do that. I don't do that on any boss, even on hardcore. I don't do that. I don't like that. So this is where I have to run away. I don't, I didn't even do that in the gauntlet. I just fight him straight up. Back to the previous act. There are lots of things that I am that I missed. Go with the spirit. And a farewell. Go make history. Um ninety seven life on this. So, is there any way... Rip. Okay. Well. Have no monies. It says 71 life on this. I'm not even using the hat. So let's swap that. That will help me, right? Well, I don't know how I'm going to swap it because I don't have a jeweler orb, right? Can I buy a jeweler orb? I bought a couple. 
There we go. I'm not going to have very many chromes either. I just need one red. Good enough. Okay. Now I got a shitload of life from that. So let's sell this and this. And this. Let's put stuff away. Let's go to my hideout real quick. And then we need to go back to Act 6. I skipped some passive points, I'm pretty sure. What can I craft on this? Fire res one time. Anything that I need to craft on. No good. Well. Back to Act 6. Let's see. Is there anything that I missed? Take that. Um... Puppet mis Mistress and Aberath. I have to do both of those, don't I? I thought I had to do both of those. So, I cannot do this yet. so let's go do those. Take a shrine. Take a double shrine, absolutely. And then my aura is on for some reason. Let's charge around as fast as we can. How did my hardcore SSF league start go? That was pretty rough. I died multiple times. The, uh, the buffs that the monsters got from the... The buffs that the monsters got from the season thing was quite devastating for me. I died several times. I was very sad. Very sad. It's dead. I need to pick my Papa John's, by the way. Brine King and, I don't know, Aberath for now. Okay, and now I need to go do Puppet Girl. Is here. Don't know where she is, try this way. Wetlands, this might be right. It was not the best league to try hardcore for the first time. Yeah, my only experience in hardcore was in the uh, gauntlet. Um, yeah, just this, like, for example, on the tankiest character that I made, got one shotted in Act 9 be or something because one of the archers got. They put plus five projectiles on them, and then they just pretty much one-shot me off screen. I was like, okay. Well. I guess I'll try to play better next time, but that one didn't really feel good. Hopefully we have them all now. Not too sure, but you would be wrong to do that here. Yeah, chain frozen. A wall. Thanks for the prime, man. Appreciate you.
Can I have the three chromes? Man, dude. The pickup radius in this game is a little bit brutal, wouldn't you say? I'm trying to grab a couple of... Uh... Oh, I don't need to help. I know. I have three passive points now. Let's see, where, where can I place those? Uh, we need to start going this way. There's, we can pick up this, 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 and then the mastery. Yes, sir. Let's do that. Ow. Ow. I don't know which way to go. Let's try this way. Yeah, they said they're going to change it. They said they're going to increase the radius, but... Yeah, your your currently your character has to be like standing on top of the item to pick it up. Like characters do have arms. We do have arms. It's a fifty-one, and I'm a forty-nine. About to be a fifty. Okay. Don't need to farm any XP then. Right? Just gonna keep. The normal rule, which is if you see a blue, kill the blue. Do I even need to go here? The crypt? Do I need to do anything in the crypt besides the trial? Do I even need to be here? God, I hope so. There's nothing but the trial here. So I should not be here, so I'm wasting time trying. I think I go up then, right? Burn him down, burn him down. I cannot do this yet. I will take that. Let's go this way. You needed an item from there, you got baited by chat. Thanks, chat. Wah. Goodbye, time. Did I... Did I get the, uh... Here's a crafting recipe I don't have. Chat tricked me and lured me into a false sense of security. I thought I was doing good things, but then I wasn't. Thank God there was a waypoint here. We back, boys. Chat, that was pretty rude. That was pretty rude, I must say. I trusted chat. 
The trust has been completely broken except for Karamon. Then, then if Karamon betrays me, then I'm just gonna switch to becoming a SpongeBob Bikini Bottom Adventure streamer. You trusted chat with the free candy van? I'm not gonna lie to you, I would have fallen for that one too. God, I love candy. Don't know where to go, so we go around the outside. You can't be doing the wrong thing if you're going around the outside, right? Except for that one map where that thing is in the middle. Who knows where the ball? Oh my god, I went straight to it. I'm a god. Wow. Sometimes dreams do come true. Talk to Helena for my reward. Helena, where's my reward? Give me a reward. I don't know this one. I have no effing idea. That other one was perfect, actually. I should have picked the other one. Alright, what's this have? Absolutely nothing. Doesn't have fire stuff on it. Have fire stuff on it. Looks like everything here is absolute dog shit. This could be tempting. Let's just surrender those things. Don't know what to do. I don't know. Let's go here. Wait, this isn't right. Bring the black venom thing to silk. Yo. Okay. Yep. Take that. I don't know where to go. This way? Let's try this way. Give me that. Okay, I see a door. Doors are good. Does this work? Lit! Lit! 52, and I'm a 50. Okay, so we're doing good on XP. Right. Portal scrolls? I'll take those. Let's go this way. Yes! Righteous fire! Yeah, I'm trying to get a good time on my first Righteous Fire playthrough. I actually, I do have a single death, but that was only because I was face tanking a boss to see if I could survive it, and I couldn't. Other than that, I actually don't have a single death. So this could have been a hardcore run. Since it's my first run on Righteous Fire, I'm just not, I'm just taken too long to figure out how to do things and 
general, my campaign knowledge is just not where it needs to be. This guy does explodey stuff. I don't like that. Don't know where to go. Probably down this way though, right? In the den. Don't know where we're going, but maybe this is right. We're frying, guys. We're frying. Look at us go. We go in here. I don't know if this is the right place. Is there anything in the den that I need? Do I need to kill, like, a big boy in the den or something? No. No. Yes. Okay. That was very helpful. Thank you, chat. For that. Can I get a mayhaps out there? I feel like my life is a little bit low here. This is the guy that killed me in the gauntlet. And then someone in my chat last time I came here said no Rax this is not the guy who killed you in the gauntlet I was like hmm. let's see who knows who killed me in the gauntlet the guy who played store dash Wah. righteous fire heal me god damn this guy's strong Form. Fuck you. Almost died to the DoorDash guy. I had to answer my phone in the middle of the fight. Almost killed me. Yeah, I think they need to increase the uh, Ralakesh is what told me to pick. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause the timer here, guys. I'm going to go eat with Sarah. And then let's keep going, all right? Doing pretty, doing all right. We're in what was this act seven? What act is this? I'm almost in act eight. Okay, act eight and four twenty-five. Let's see. I think my PB is six hours and twenty minutes or something ever on any build. So let's see if we can finish this off here. What platform do I use for using music? Spotify. Be right back one sec.
I just ate a turkey, ham, and roast beef sub. I loaded it with every veggie that they had except tomatoes, and I tore off almost all of the bread. So I ate no carbs. I ate some fresh deli lunch meat, and I ate green peppers and pickles and black olives and onions and a bunch of veggies. But, and then the... The banana peppers, the jalapenos, lots of vitamin C in those peppers. This song is not in my playlist, by the way. Did I save some food for you? Oh, I need to start the timer again. I didn't. And that was rude of me. Three points, huh? So this, and then which one does he take here? He takes... Corrupted blood cannot be inflicted on me. Now what am I doing? Now I'm grabbing these, and then I'm grabbing those down there. Pick up the mana reservation so I can use determination. Okay. Okay, yeah, I remember him saying that. Okay. Oh, wait, I remember this. This is like fireflies, right? Is this like dread thicket? Dread thicket, and then we... Dragon Thicket, Fireflies, I'm trying to remember. Am I going all the wrong ways? Probably going all the wrong ways. What is this? Dread Thicket, nope, I ran straight to it. Can't teach that, boys. Okay, I have to kill this guy, I'm pretty sure. I definitely need determination, man. These guys are really dicking me. Another unique. Okay, here's a crafting recipe. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, let's try Turquoise. Hopefully we get some life on this one. No life, no fire res. Thank you for the worst piece of shit that's ever been found. This has 32 fire res on it. But I need the links though. 80, 88 life on these boots. 25 movement speed, 34 fire res, 26 int. These are goaded. But I don't have any jeweler's orbs. I got three of them. Alright. Dude, these things are so good. Okay. It's a start. Probably never get what I want here, but... Uh I just I greet you. <clears throat> oh, I have three chromes right here, by the way. Okay, this is close. I can definitely deal with this. Okay. Can I... Come on, game. Work with me here. Thank you. Okay, that's... That's a massive increase for me. Okay, the reservation is... Resist, resist, resist... I don't see him actually going for reservation. Where, where is the reservation? I don't see where the reservation is. It's by the minions. Oh. oh. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's go to the hideout real quick. I can't put... Fire res or anything. Any idea what I should take here? Should I take int and dex? I just just craft nothing, right? It's got just craft nothing for for now. The boots are uh, life, fire as movement speed, into energy shield. So we have a suffix open. I guess I could craft like dex and int or something. Definitely need to get determination on. Yeah, just wait till I need something. Yeah. Yes, sir. I don't want to do gray peacock. Okay, let's do the next thing. When are you supposed to do the second lab? Am I am I already supposed to have done it? You do it as you enter Act 8. Okay, I'm... 
I'm not in Act 8, though, right? This is Act 7? Okay, so pretty much right now, okay. This is the thing that I never, I always run past it. It's like in the middle and I'm very, very bad at skipping it. So let's see if for once in my life I can actually find it quickly, but I never can. Like ever. Hint big wall. Hint big wall. Let's see if there's any universe where we can actually find where this thing is. I'm sure we will do a terrible job at it, like we always do. Looks like we have the same problem we always have. See, we uncover the entire map. Maybe it's right here in the middle or something. Okay. Well, that wasn't the worst thing ever. Is this the, this is the way to the final boss, right? In uh, at this act or something. What I would like to do, if possible, yeah, I need to do the lab, but the problem is, is I would like to get determination before I do the lab. And in order to do that, I need two levels. I need two levels. To use determination. I'm still playing without determination. I need two points to get the reservations to use it. Is there is there a waypoint in here or no? Maybe I could take determination with me. I can drop purity of elements, maybe. There's no waypoint here. All right. Does this boss do physical damage? Can I fight this boss without the lab? He does chaos. All right, so the lab's not going to save me, right?
think I need... Where is it? And then we need the... Or is that the only one that I needed? Or do I also need the mastery? Yeah, I need, I definitely need determination. I'm feeling it. All the physical hits just pound me. They take me to Pound Town, USA. Take out purity. Okay. I will when we're at the boss here. I don't know if I'm going the right way. I hope I am. Doesn't look like it. Looks like I went the wrong way. Story of my life. Another thing is, I don't even know if I have a red socket. That's another million dollar question. I might not have a red socket. from Act 3, a leveled one. Okay. We are almost to the point where we have that reservation mastery. I'm guessing this is, is this the boss, maybe? The quest guy, okay. Need some help. I don't have a red socket. Uh, I guess maybe for now I'll just get rid of the stone golem. Let's see if we can cast this. Yeah, I need the mastery. So I need to kill anything here. Let's see if I can get three bars here. Is three bars a thing? Maybe there'll be a couple elites over here that I could kill right before the boss. <sighs> Not quite. Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's just go down. Oh, there's another floor. Thank God. So 
Stone Golem is dog shit, it's just free. Yeah. So that's gonna be the boss. Would like two bars of XP before we do that, please. Two bars of XP before we do that, and then we will do the lab. Ow. Don't tell me there aren't enough monsters in here to level, level me up. Come on, dude. <laughs> oh my god. I guess let's put a portal in front of the boss room and go to some random zone. Here's a... Here's a big boy. Perfectly planned. So we need the reservation node, and we are going to take... Actually, he doesn't even take the reservation mastery. I don't understand. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to take out purity? He doesn't even take this. You lose vita drop vitality. Okay. So we can get the stone golem back. We can't go in without our stone golem, guys. It's the greatest thing ever. Yeah, I don't... I don't think he takes the other two nodes. You would take those later, okay? Pox is still here, Pog. What's up, Pox? Um, I'm gonna go... Okay, I just got a waypoint, right? If I just got a waypoint, let's try the second lab. So then what was I doing down here? I was gonna grab... Uh, a bunch of life nodes down here, right? Ascend with precision. <laughs> I'm the god of ARPGs for simpletons. <laughs> the god.
pot of ARPGs for simpletons. I'll take it, man. The god of ARPGs for simpletons. Wisdom is the offspring of suffering and time. The simple god for the simple people. Well, I don't want to go in here, but here I go anyway. Don't want to be here, I'm crying. Damn it. A double door. Imagine putting doors in ARPGs. Can you imagine? An emperor strikes without it is the sovereign who empowers to entertain doubt to other ways. Imagine putting doors in an ARPG. Ben versus Rax is the war of the gods. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I don't think that I am a better player than Ben. I think Ben is a tier above in terms of gameplay. I think is a tier above even even the best players. I think he's one tier higher. Do you think Woody is also one tier higher than everybody else? I think there are people that would agree with that. Woody is a great player. There's no doubt about it. Damn it. I guess we have to go down. But for some reason it's not working. I thought I gotta go down and left. And then it should be up. If I'm reading the map correctly, but I might I might be reading this completely wrong. Should turn this way. I'm wasting a bunch of time here. This has gone very poorly. Why not use PoE Lab? I think by the time I... The honest answer is I think by the time I had pulled it up and looked at it, I could have already just ran through half of it. Maybe I'm wrong. 
I need to actually check. Is this like just a complete dead end no matter what or what? Yeah, there is no way out of here. This might be it. Wonder this guy might be able to kill me, let's see. Okay, so the green thing seems to be a t is that a portal? Ports me away. And now we are going for Ramako. Who would be wrong to do that here? Many goodbyes. My I mean, that's better than mine, but I don't have the currency to fix it. I just don't have the currency. I'm just too poor to fix anything. If it's not just straight up better exactly what I need, it's just not going to work currently. So now I need... Swap flammability for punishment. Uh, uh, I don't even think I have a red gem to do it with. So let's see, where is flammability? Uh, 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 um, um, uh, yeah, that's what I was going to try to do is do the weapon. I was like, uh, punishment. Okay, uh, so how, how is that? Okay, how about that? Are we, now, are we, now are we playing the game? Always crits, huh? Doesn't sound good. Always crits, huh? Punishment goes into effect when they're low. Oh, yeah, I was reading about it. It's like low life something. Thank you.
Might be able to use that ring mail, by the way. This might be better than mine. Put molten shell. Yeah, cast wind damage taken molten shell. Okay, we just hit five hours. So obviously that's not good at all, but. Starting act eight, so I have, I have to do three acts, a lab and kill Katava in an hour and 15. That's probably not gonna happen, right? And I have to do all the quests that give, uh, points as well while I'm doing it all. Yeah, I just... Unfortunately, I'm just so confused. Let's try to keep it under 7 at least. So we can retain some of our dignity. Definitely feels one trillion times better with determination. I feel like it's just required, right? Yeah, we need to swap it out soon. I don't know what those valves do, but there's a valve, I click it. Resets the ground effects, okay. Let's try to stay on the edge here. Ed, did I go to the wrong side? Is this not the side you're supposed to go to? Oh, 
Oh, uh, I will do the I will do the quest. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I know we got to go both ways and complete some quests. Can I jump over this? The Kui. The Kui. Well, I clicked it 300 times. Maybe one of these days will actually open. Einhard, what? Why are you always in so much trouble? <laughs> Am I going to play Torchlight Infinite? I'm thinking about it might play it for a day or two the announcement like the hype trailer if i'm being on it like when we watched it together the other day it was pretty it was pretty special i must say um but uh i will the actual updates sounded pretty damn good actually The updates sounded great. The presentation was questionable at best. 
creepy. That's a good way to... By the way, that girl is not AI. That's a real-life person, by the way. We were debating the whole time, is it real or AI? That girl's a real person. Tor Torchlight tweeted it. Not AI. Which is actually kind of incredible. I just have no idea where I'm going. I'm just running forward. Okay, I remember. Is this the is this the zone where the black legionnaires are in front of the door, and somehow I didn't kill them, even though they were right in front of the door or something? Look for the book icon, that's where they are. Okay, it's a nice hint. Look for the book icon, guys. Here, oh, book, book. Excusey. Pretty simple. I see a road, I follow the road. Easy as that. Where did the road go? Wah. I'm crying. Oh, here it is. Did the road debate me again? I don't know where to go. Just running really far this way and praying that it's right. Oh, door. I see a door. Why is my thing so small? That's what she said. Why is my thing so small? I mean, my righteous fire or... should go maybe this way it's always a mystery with me you know, just, just go any direction and pray huh I don't know let's go this way what might be this way you never know oh my god I went straight to the door god I love that he's using T HUD Get them down, boys. Yes, sirree, Bob.
Burn him down, burn him down, yep. Almost got two points, I like that. Sun orb, find the moon orb. Where in the world would I find that? It's a uh, You're Don't do anything on good. I can. There is nothing else. Would everybody stop trying to give me stuff? Here's an armor energy shield thing. This is what he said I was looking for. Could use an orb of binding here. It's terrible. It's terrible. There we go. But now, so this is way better than mine by a million miles. But I would need to chrome this and it'll never work. Hello. Can I take this off? See, absolutely not. But this is much better than mine. It's time for crafting, boys. I need int on this thing. I can't put int on it. Or no, I need... I need dex. Need 123 int. I can just get a new frost blink, right? Is at last clear. Thanks, warm nights. Okay, do level one frost blink. Okay. I got two more chromes. Watch this one, boys. Oh my god, yes. Mm. 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 Can't teach that, boys. Just gained almost 400 or er, 400 life there. Check the armor increase. Yeah, it's a massive increase. All right, let's go, bro. 
Yo, I am still in Act 8. That's how garbage I am. Ugh. Talk to Mimosa. Okay. God, I'm bad. Uh, find the moon orb, okay. Where would, if I was a moon orb, where would I be? Maybe this way? We've done, we've done two of the labs, yeah. I need to finish Act 8, I need to finish Act 9 and 10, and then I need to do the lab and see what kind of a time we can get. Um, we're already at five and a half hours, so this is obviously a terrible run, but I'm trying. I'm trying my best here. Man, I miss faster attacks on this. Boy, do I miss faster attacks. Ah, uh, the Lunaris boss is in the Solaris Temple? Okay, thank you. Thank you for your help. I'm playing SSF, yes. I am playing SSF. I don't know which way to go. Let's try down. Wrong way. Story of my life. I don't know where I'm going. There's a ghosty boy. I'm afraid of ghosty boys. Let's keep going. Okay. Can I click it from over here? I can. I like that. I can't pick up an item unless it's inserted into my rectum, but I can click the other... Is that a five link? No, it's... Please don't be a dead end. I just ran in a giant loop-de-loop. -loop. That's upsetting. I'm leveling Frost Blink again. Oops. My bad. He's leveling Frost Blink again. Damn it. I had one job. Rax, don't level Frost Blink. Okay, I can do that. No, I can't. I'm a 58 in a 59 zone. That's good. It's about what we want, right? Don't know where to go. Let's try going this way. Did I go the right way, maybe? This boss isn't hard. Who would be wrong? 
going to do that here. Do I have to kill Yugal? I do, don't I? Damn, so many things to do. Went the wrong way, it looks like. Is it down here then? We're going to go back and kill Yogurt here. I'm guessing he's to the left. Is that where he is? Like, is he? Is this, her, is this right? Okay, this is not right. <laughs> it's up and to the left and then swing around, right? Should be up and to the left, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's this way. Okay, the trial's in my way. Wah. I thought it was to the left. Yeah. Here, right?
Is that a crafting recipe? No. It would be wrong to do that here. The life mastery, we are taking nothing. We're not taking that. Okay, I think maybe I took everything. I think I took everything that he asked. Go next. Now we are. We're going this way. I have another point. Let's keep walking that way. Okay. Okay, let's try it. Let's try a slash passives. I have 18 passives starting act nine. Does that sound right? I have no idea. Um, did I give out the code for the no rest for the wicked? Yes but it only works starting April 18th. So, exclamation no rest, there's the code for you. Doesn't work until April 18th. On April 18th, you can buy it. And it normally costs $40 for the game. That code will make it cost 32. You get $8 off. Eight bucks off, can't beat it. I cannot do this yet. I did try the game. Um, I played it on early access. Um, it's very fun, but it's very hard. Very, very difficult. To, to give you a comparison, um, I played in the hardcore PoE gauntlet, which was apparently the hardest gauntlet ever a few months ago. In my opinion, No West for the Wicked is way harder, way harder than the PoE hardcore gaunt gauntlet that just came out. So if you like very challenging Dark Souls-like games, then you're going to love it. And if you don't, if you like running forward with righteous fire where nothing can stop you, then you are not going to like it at all. It's very, very difficult. What's up, boiler? They say it's going to change the ARPG genre. It's very good. It's very fun. But you are going to get your ass beat into the ground. That's a guarantee. You're going to die 
hundreds of times, no matter how good of a gamer you are. It's not, it's just not going to save you. You just gotta, you have to learn the boss fights and you have to learn on the very first, the very first monster that I fought, one single monster, one white zombie, he killed me like three or four times in a row until you have to learn the timing, how to block, how to parry, how to dodge. You you can't not do the mechanics. You will die if you don't do them. You can't do anything. So, like, for example, pulling two white mobs is extremely dangerous. It's a skill issue, not gonna lie. You're a god tier gamer, not gonna happen. Alright, Sir Beard. Let me know. You follow along with me on April 18th. Let's see who gets further. And, uh, I, if I'm ahead of you, remember, I died many, many, I'm gonna die many, many, many times. But it, it is very rewarding. It's re it makes it rewarding when you win, because it's hard. The game that I'm talking about is No Rest for the Wicked. It's a Souls... It's essentially Dark Souls. It's way more Dark Souls than an ARBG. As Karamon said, it's Dark Souls with an ARPG camera. You are... You see what I'm doing here? You see how I'm zooming, just mowing everything down? I'd, you will never do this in No Rest for the Wicked. It's impossible. Well, I don't know. Maybe the end game is like this, but... The beginning of the game is literally like you're inching forward and praying not to see a single monster. You're just praying that the, the next step isn't your last. V Rising contacted me as well. They want me to stream... They want me to stream their launch, and it's coming in a few weeks as well. I looked into it, and it seems like a pretty good game from my from my limited research. Yeah, the Divine Orb. Ooh! Divine Orb in Act 9 in SSF. Lol. All I have to say to that is lol. Divines aren't nearly as good, and I mean, I know that it is a good currency, but I would imagine a divine is way better in trade than an SSF. Kill Boulderback? Who? Oh, this guy? Uh, yo, he died. I couldn't even, didn't even realize I was fighting him until he, and he was already dead. A divine orb, huh?
You had a feeling that I would like this build? I don't know whether that's a compliment or not. Are you calling me a simpleton? Because you're right. Now, the the main reason that I like this build, the, the main thing for me, I do like how I don't have to do anything. I love that. But the real reason I like it is because the entire time, I'm just mashing my movement skills. I'm just mashing movement. I love that. It's mucho el funo. Ow. This guy's a pee pee head. Ow, ow. I cannot carry this. Can I game? Just pick up the fucking thing, thank you. It seems boring. Wrong. Uh. It's fun. Okay, the added fire does so all of that. 40% elemental. Can I craft fire on it? Okay, I mean, I can't even wear it. Who cares? Just sell it. Alright, I got no idea what I'm doing. Nice, I didn't get a single waypoint that I needed. I love it when that happens. I love it when I run through 300 zones and don't get a single waypoint that I need. You wanna know what? I think it might actually be faster if I just leave from town. I don't know. Imagine missing every waypoint. I honestly can't tell if you're being sarcastic about about what. I mean, I say a lot of things. Being sarcastic about which one. Can I has a waypoint? Found one lit. Love waypoints. Okay, what do I need to do? Find the storm blade. Uh, am I enjoying? I I'm I love this, but I'm not even not kidding. Just build rules. No kappa. This build is godly.
This build rocks. I see what you did there, Woody. What's up, man? God, I love doing nothing. Superior Divine Life Flask. Gotta pick that up. Obviously. I'm guessing we take this thing... Oh god, I see the unveil thing over there. Give me the shield, I guess. Well, until next time. 76 life and all res. Okay. I like that. I just need a single green. Thanks, God. Can't put life or fire res on it. How about flat armor? Or percent armor? 74% of... 35% of 400 is what? Is that 140? 140 or 75. Okay, so I guess percent then. Yeah, significantly better. The pit keep your eyes sharp. When I was Well, when you have armor to stack, I thought the percent armor is local. So it would percent armor gave me 124 there. The other roll was 75. So this roll was way better, right? Talk to Petrus and Vanya. Didn't I already? Petaris. What the hell? Petaris and Van Vanja. Give me the bottled storm for the love of God. Hits William Tell Jackson. What's up, dude? Grass crown. What's up, guys? Thank you so much for the subs. Okay, I don't have my Blood Rage at the moment. Because I don't have any... Green Sockets, nor do I have any Chromes.
Am I enjoying SSF over trade? Uh, I'll be honest with you, I haven't really gotten far enough. I haven't really played too much of the league yet because I've spent my entire time dying on hardcore. I haven't really gotten a chance to really play. But I am enjoying it. What I really like about it is I don't like I don't I like the feeling that I don't have to trade. You know what I mean? I don't have to use all these third party programs, this or that, analyze this, PoE stack that, this or that, this or that. How much is this worth? Am I getting scammed or not? I don't know where the I don't know where the boss is. I can't find her. Isn't there a boss in here? Maybe that's it up there. This seems... Oh yeah, it's the scorpion boy, right? Blessings. You killed. Okay, um. Go back up there. How's Righteous Fire coming along? It's fun, man. I just uh, started five hours, well, six hours ago. I'm kind of sad this is going to take me, looks like it's going to take me six and a half hours to beat this if I'm lucky. It might be closer to seven, which is kind of brutal. It's not a good time, but... I guess it's okay for never having played it before. Boiling Lake, huh?
One nice thing is we did get to 3,000 health. That's pretty cool. Find the Basilisk Acid. I don't get it. Where's the Basilisk? Oh, here. My mother is gone. And now farewell. The poor knights. Am I confident in season four of Diablo four? Will it deliver the goods? I think it's going to be a significant improvement. Um, I have a feeling it's going to be a better experience for a similar result, meaning the result of uh, pretty much any season for any ARPG is you end up at the end of it bored, right? You're like, I'm bored. I'm not playing anymore till next season. That's going to happen again in Diablo 4. The pit is not going to solve all of the endgame problems. But I think people will play longer. And I think that the while they are playing, I think their enjoyment is going to be higher. So that's really all you can ask for. So if you played season three for two days and you were like, God, these pets suck and you quit. Maybe season four will entertain you for a week, maybe a week and a half. So trending in the right direction. Is this going to... Uh, completely flip everybody's opinion on Diablo 4? No. Quite a bit better, though. Okay. Yeah, was it the... Was it the three colored... sockets? The three... The three socket color items that vendor for a chrome? Did I miss one? Okay, it's six hours and still in Act 9. That's not good. I really wish that the game would zoom back into where you were in the passive tree. It feels like it either, I don't know what it does, either always goes back to the beginning or I don't know what it does, but it never, it's never showing me where I was. And I have to go look for it every time. If you're like a pro, I'm sure that doesn't confuse you, but it sure confuses me.
it always stays unless you log out. Oh, may I log out all the time, though. That must be it. It stays, but I log out all the time to save portal scrolls. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. So I guess that probably doesn't impact the super noobs that don't know about that. Okay, so this is a chrome, you're saying, okay. So I'm just not used to this loot filter. Like I fought so bad there. I don't have any fuck. I didn't come down here with any flask charges. That was really dumb. I didn't come to... Not porting out the shit's weak. Damn, that was a huge mistake.
Rax YPOE. Uh, lost a bet. Nah, because POE is fun. I haven't used the Quicksilver for several acts. Does Quicksilver make you shield charge faster? Because all I do is press shield charge and teleport. Okay, it does. Yeah, I guess I should be spamming three movement skills instead of two. Good old PoE, even when you play the build, even when you play the build that presses nothing, you're still not pressing enough, imagine. Hello, in order to use the correct movement speed on the easiest to play build, you must spam three keys. Pure madness, I tell you. Yeah, I put I only put the ruby flask there for decoration because if I don't put the ruby flask there, then people will say, "Rax, why don't you put a why don't you take off your mana flask there in that slot? You don't need it. Why don't you put a ruby flask?" So what I've done there is I put a ruby flask there so people wouldn't say that to pretend like I would ever press it, but um there's too many buttons in this game, so I just don't even press it. the same reason why do you see how my movement ability is on left click i don't i don't use left click so i usually just leave that blank i put the movement on left click only so people don't tell me to put movement on left click not because i actually use it same same logic
they just keep resurrecting, what happened? I don't know what to do. I think we have to go this way to kill somebody. Some, like, Valentina or some nonsense or something. Val... I can't really remember. This is, but maybe there's a waypoint in here that I need or something. Reliquary. Can I have a waypoint? Lit. Unique number 178. Teleport through this? No. Man.
Simon Tide waits in ambush. Always keep your eyes on the horizon. Danny, you return to the ship. Ah, I see. It is good to remember that you none of them needs goodbye. us. Bannon. Kind of, hello? Wait, wait, what? Freedom comes. Okay. Do I need to do the uh, the the reliquary? Do I have to do the reliquary, guys? I'm not on hardcore. I'm playing SSF softcore. I haven't died, though. Okay, go to lab. Okay. I did die in the be very beginning, but I only because I was trying to face see if I could face tank a boss. So I haven't actually... Other than that, I haven't died a single time. So hopefully we don't die at Kataba. Yeah, I have the lab because I've leveled my detonate dead character. So I do have the the lab done. What happened? What my righteous fire turned off or what I didn't turn it on or what happened? My first flask is the problem. Removes burning. Okay, my flask. There's a flask mod that removes righteous fire. Path of exile. I say this in the most respectful way possible. What the fuck is wrong with you?
Okay, I'm three levels behind here. I'm only level 65. Maybe that's part of my problem. Are you ready to go outside soon? Oh, okay. Is your demon hunter a god? He's trying. And now that you've fully built your Diablo 3 characters, now you can uninstall Diablo 3 and play Path of Exile. <laughs> Diablo 3 is fun for like two days. you want I can take Callie on an adventure we can have some bonding time if you want to do that she will listen to me because if she doesn't I'll just pick her up and give her a tombstone pile driver Unless there's somebody at the door, I have almost never had Callie like not listen to me. Like I can't even remember a single time. Maybe it's happened, but very rarely. Yeah, you. I'm talking about you, Cam. Yeah, I'm talking about you. I don't want to do a puzzle. Wee. I hate puzzles. Wee. Wee. I'm doing a puzzle. Wee. What? I'm in the final lab and then I have to kill the final boss and that's it. Wee, I had to do something. That was annoying. Wee. Probably, but it will not be easy. Probably have to play Natalia. You probably have to play Natalia. And Natalia is never what you want to play. Same answer. Yes, but it will be tough. Necros, when you create your level 1 character, it gives you the achievement for clearing a 150. You don't even have to play anything. You don't even have to push any buttons. It's over. 150 is already cleared. If you can't clear a 150 on a Necro this season, then you just suck at the game. Like, I'm sorry, but you just suck at Diablo. You suck at Diablo 3 if you can't do it. 
There's no hope for you if you can't do it. No other way to say it. It's just way too free. An aspirant can afford to be promising. An emperor must anybody could do it. Your necro right now is too squishy for 150, right, but yes, but remember this is also the season just started, right? Like, go ahead and get some gons, get full augs, get, you know, level up your gems, go ahead and get everything, and then when you go in there, you are, you're guaranteed to win, right? Which two do I take this time? I take... Do I take this one? The Explode? Or do I take... Do I take the Explodey one? Okay, take the Explode. Okay, now let us see... If we can, uh, if we can beat Katava here, if we can beat Katava here, then is this where I was supposed to go or no? Is this the wrong area? I thought I was supposed to. Must be in the wrong spot. Where's I supposed to go? Is it the ossuary? That that's not right, is it? Oh, hello. Okay. Level 66 here. I cannot do this yet. Okay, we got the explodey stuff. Chisel, why not?
just keep rushing up here. I wasn't ready, Katava. Wah. You started attacking me when I wasn't ready. What a piece of shit. Exactly know what he's doing. I don't know what to do, man. There's red everywhere. Can I get close to him without dying? That doesn't look good. health potions. Oh, I better just stay right by him. My mana is gone. I saw that slime. I dodged that one. Should be fine right here, right? I'm scared. I'm scared. You can see at the you can see on the chat I have died one time, but actually I died zero times. My death was after I got the node with capped fire res gives you life regen. I wanted to see if I could just face tank a boss, and the answer is you can't. So I died one time for science. So I didn't actually die one time the whole time, which is crazy. I have one death for science. Didn't die any other time, so that's pretty crazy, actually. There's a guy who said I died three times and was being weird. Sir Beard, are you telling me that there's dumbasses on the internet? Are you serious? That can't be right. There's no way that's right. Everyone on the internet is an expert at everything and speaks the truth. Kung Fusion, Newbie, Senevix. Thank you so much for the subs. How am I liking Righteous Fire? 
I would say this is within my top two favorite builds I've ever played. This and, and uh, the Bone Zone Juggernaut, I think, are the my two favorites. I, I just did it, Ginger. One more time. Deaths. I have one death. It was at the go back, check the VOD. I just stood in front of Piety to see if she could even kill me. And turns out she can if I just stand in all of her attacks. That was my only death. Time to try Venom Geyer. Is that... I've heard of that. Is that how you say it? Geyer? Venom Gyre. If I did this again, a six hour campaign is not good. If it's not a six hour campaign, it's a 637. I'm hoping if I did it again that I could do it in five, five flat. I'm hoping I could cut an hour 37 off of it. G Ray. Yeah, I didn't have I didn't have any twink gear. I did use a few orbs of binding, but other than that, I didn't use I did I didn't use anything crazy. I used stuff that you could actually use on like a season start. Six thirty seven though is freedom comes to those very, very, very bad time. By the way, I didn't check to see. We need twenty four passives, right? There's one I didn't I don't have. I don't have Kitaba's Torments or Ruler of Highgate. Okay, so I missed I missed two or did I do them and I just turn, didn't turn it in let me see oh did I miss one I think I, maybe I just need to turn them in let me see uh, which one is ruler of highgate so I didn't do that one what was the other one I didn't do Katava's Torments. Katava's got to be Act 5? Okay, I didn't do that one either. God, I'm stupid. Okay. So it was 637. Let me reset this and just start again. Let's do these two quests. So it's going to be more like 645 now. Travel to the reliquary. Okay. Oops, I skipped two quests because I suck. Uh, I'll take that chrome, by the way. So we're going to add this time to 637. However long these two quests take. Kill Uchula. I don't think we need to kill Uchula. But. Kill him anyway. Where, where are they? Oh, here. Gone. Okay. Reliquary. Reliquary. If I was a reliquary, where would I be? Okay. Oh, I know this quest. This is the quest where you go to all the little corners and pick up the, the little pieces, right? I remember this.
Oh yeah. I forgot to do this one. Damn it. I the ruler of Highgate, that one is the one where you you get to pick who's the ruler and it doesn't matter at the end, right? Pretty sure. I got another reward. Holy cow, this shit sucks. Okay, that was actually better than I thought it was going to be. This has higher fire resist. But the other one has 300 more armor. That was actually pretty good, though. That was better than I was thinking it was going to be. The other one is in Act 9. I have no idea what to do. Where do I go? Save. Find Oyen and save her from Kira. Uh, I think it's this way. I, don't, I, I really don't know. Let's try it this way. I think it's this way. Is this it? Shrine of the Winds? Yeah, all right. Can I just stand in this? Does this even do anything? Okay, those winds actually kind of hurt. Boy, all this forced phasing sure is fun. My love. Not okay, so it was a 641. Right, now we're done, asses. 24. Okay, it's a 641, not a 637. Okay. Not bad. No deaths under 7 hours. Never played the build before. <laughs> Pretty good. For the first try. I'll take it. So let me see here. So right down here, we have this whole wheel that we need. He takes both of these. Now. And then he goes over here to get these things. So I guess let's take these first while we're here. And we're also supposed to take the 10% increased effect will be the next thing that we get. And then...
He specs out of these two. And goes these two. Problem is, is I don't know if I can take this node out without ruining my build. 17 more decks required. Let's take it and see what broke. It's from Blood Rage, right? So we can just take Blood Rage out. And then we can take out Swift Affliction. We can just buy new ones, right? You don't use Blood Rage anymore? You just, you don't use it at all? Let's do that. And let's just go Swift. Affliction. It's okay, I'll just start with baby gems. They'll level in two seconds, not a big deal. It'll be all right. Okay, don't need either of those things. And now in my passive tree, now I take these two instead. These two nodes are incredible. Just double checking my build here, making sure that we've got some nice stuff here. So, okay. All right, it looks like we got everything correct. And now what we are going to do is next we're going to walk over here and grab all of this damage stuff. Get all this damage. Okay. It's going to be nice. When does he use the AoE gem? Let me see. Uh, never, unless it's uh, yeah, all the way to ninety three. He's not using it. Where is it? Here. 93. This is exactly what I have right now. Righteous Fire Burning Elemental Efficacy. That's what I have right now. I do have, yeah, I have the passive tree nodes for it, which are here. These, right? Area of effect, area damage, area of effect. I don't know if he ever picks this one up later. Let me see. He does pick up the other one as well. You said you can swap efficacy with increased AoE. I'm going to be honest with you. After playing it, when I when I watch people play Righteous Fire, when I'm looking at it as a viewer, 
It looks like the it looks like the area is way too small. But then you actually play it and it doesn't it doesn't feel small at all. It feels fine. Like I'm not sitting there saying, "God, I wish this circle was bigger." What what I'm sitting you don't know what I was thinking the whole campaign? God, I hate shield charge in hallways. All I kept thinking was, God, I hate shield charge in hallways. That was it. The area actually feels pretty strong. I would rather it just do more damage, honestly. Feels fine. Well, is it is it 3500 HP pretty good for Man, it's really devastating, though, that Kataba lowered my resistances. I only have 152% lightning res. It's terrible. Kataba really nerfed me. only have plus 283 damn the struggle is real Am I blasting this tomorrow or back to D3? I'm done with Diablo 3 for this season. Um, I can comfortably commit to like the the opening weekend for Diablo 3, um, and then I'm and then I'm done. I might have been able to play a day or two longer if my hardcore character. Here's another thing that I'm thinking about. No, first of all, I had an absolute blast playing with Seattle, Sarah, Amy, Ellie, and Kirk. I loved playing with them. But I think next time when I do Diablo 3, I think I'm going to stick to hardcore SSF. When I go, when I go group play softcore, I just it's the game just feels so easy. It's just it's just too easy, man. Diablo 3 they just hand you everything for free. You at least got to go hardcore SSF just to give yourself any kind of a challenge. This is going to be your Z Barb teammate. There's a lot of barbs out there, buddy. Am I going to play PoE until Season 4 of Diablo 4? Well, No Rest for the Wicked comes out in three days. I was thinking about playing that. It's going to be a very hard ARPG, brand new in three days. Um... But hopefully I will be able to beat that pretty soon. I don't think that game is... I don't know, like how long is it going to take me to beat that game? I don't know how big of a game it is. I'm guessing not very long, but 
maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just hard as hell. So I would say no rest for the wicked at the, at the latest, at the latest, I'd be done with it by Sunday, unless I suck. And then I'm, my plan is to go back to PoE. I, 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 I've said this multiple times. Some people don't believe me. Like, some people make up their own narratives, which is crazy. Like, I just tell you guys the answer, and then people get it in their minds that know it's some other answer. I've said it a million times. I think PoE is the best ARPG right now. Like, this is the most fun one to play. Even when it's royally pissing me off, even when it's killing five of my hardcore characters, I still think currently this is the best ARPG right now. We are going to play through Grim Dawn. It's 100%. We're going to do it, Blanco. It's going to happen. Yeah, like, for those of you, like, there might be a lot of people in chat that say, well, for me, Path of Exile is not the best ARPG right now. It's it's Last Epoch or it's Diablo or something. I think at least 90% of people who say PoE is not the best one just haven't really gotten into it. You, you did a playthrough, or maybe you haven't played it at all, or you just did one playthrough and it was too confusing, it was too overwhelming, and you quit, and you didn't like it, and you couldn't, you couldn't get into it. But anybody who has gotten, you know, over that hump and gotten kind of into PoE, it's very hard to place the other games higher than it. It's, they just aren't there. It's just not there, man. For you, the issue is popping flasks. There are way too many buttons to press in Path of Exile to play correctly. And this is coming from someone that has 14,000 hours on World of Warcraft Elemental Shaman. I have every single totem keybound and memorized, and I will use them to annihilate you in PvP. I can do it in raids. I have... I can play I can play a build with 40 keybinds no problem. In an ARPG that's about zooming, there's way too many fucking buttons to press. Way too many buttons to press for offense, way too many to press for defense, way too many things that are situational this or that or this or that. The number of buttons has got to come down. It's just stupid, man. You won't think that in another thousand hours. I, I will, Kaito. I will. I automate my flasks all the time. I know exactly how to do it. I know exactly what the recipe is. That's when you feel like you have a full build. When everything is automated, when you have cast on damage taken, when you have the auto trigger, four second triggering superpower on your weapon or whatever, cast on crit instead of casting it manually, only after you have all of those things built does the game feel really fun. And that's perfectly fine for the blasters, but all the noobs that are trying to get to that point to enjoy the game, they have to press an entire piano full of keys to get there.
it's fine though. We're getting there. Now I just need to automate all my flasks. And then we need to farm for some boss killing build. I mean, I already have the detonate dead character kind of built. So maybe I could just farm gear. I would much rather farm on this guy than on the other guy. And then when we have everything, maybe we switch back. Yeah, this is how far I am. I'm not... I'm not super far in the tree yet. My detonate dead is on, uh, shit, I don't know. Uh, yeah, necro. Yeah, I'm going to play Righteous Fire against the first four bosses just to... I don't even know what they do, man. I know Maven has a Simon Says. I know one of them throws fireballs. I don't have a clue what the other two do. And I have no idea what the other attacks are besides those two attacks. I don't know how the fireball phase works, and I don't know how the Simon Says phase works. I just, I just know that they're there. I couldn't I don't know if I could name the four bosses. Maven, Searing Exarch, Eater of Worlds, Elder. Uber Elder. Oh. Okay. Shaper. Okay. Is it serious or is it serious? Let me see. It's serious, right? I see people call him serious all the time, but that's not his name. Cranky, Omni, Crip, Yuri. Thank you so much for the subs, guys. Eater, Exarch, Maven, and Uber Elder. Okay. All right. Well, we'll see if I if I can do it. Let's build our righteous fire boy out and see if we can get anything done. I had a lot of fun today. Thank you for being here, guys. Thanks to Pox for all the help. Let's find a lovely person to raid here. Who can we raid? <sighs> Righteous Fire is fun. I really like this build, man. DM is playing with Pox. Why don't we raid DM? I haven't raided DM in a, in a while, right? Guys, thank you so much for being here. Tomorrow, PoE. The next day, PoE. The next day, uh, the brand new ARPG. Uh, what's it called? No Rest for the Wicked. I'll play that until I beat it. I hope I beat it quickly, a day or two. Back to PoE until Diablo 4. I won't wait until the new season for Diablo 4. I'll go back a few days before, probably, to mess around, get get warmed up. 
but it should be good. You too, Ghost Runner. Thanks for everything, guys. Thanks for the follows. Thanks for the subs. Thanks for the likes on YouTube. Appreciate you guys. Hope you have a fantastic night. Thank you.